Hello, everybody. Let's see if we can be heard out in the other world. You guys listening? All right. Well, I'm Tim. I will be your GM today in a game of Shadow of the Demon Lord. And listening to myself in the background because I didn't mute the tab is really irritating. <laughs> Immediate technical difficulties. Get them out of the way now. Yep. <laughs> I want to know. We're also this is the first there time we're running on several programs. So, <laughs> well, this is my first time running an actual stream using OBS and various other sources too. So that makes a big difference. So, um, let me just uh, test to make sure I can hear everybody else out there on Streamland. So. Go ahead and speak up once, and then as you introduce yourself, we'll start with Tommy. I can, and uh, away we go. Sure, I'll be your sound test. My name is Tommy. Um, you can find me uh, most. I stream a lot on TTRB Theater. There's a lot of shows there. Just go. They have a YouTube channel that has a bunch of stuff, and I'm on most of the World of Darkness things. This is the first time I'm playing this game specifically. And uh, I don't know the mechanics at all. So we're going to see how this goes. I'm going to learn along the way. All right. Excellent. So it seems like we got everybody's audio working, or at least there. So we'll go right over to Francesca. Well, introduce yourself and uh, real quick hello, and we will then move on to the next person. Uh, hi, my name is Francesca. Um, I've never played this game before. Uh, I've played Zyhander for the last year and having some experience with D&D &D 5e, but that's about it. Well, hopefully this will be easy enough for you. I know how you <laughs> roll dice, so that should be fun. Oh, okay. <laughs> we should all hopefully survive the first half hour. We're doing well. So. I didn't make a take this time, so. <laughs> oh. All right, Stephen, how are you, sir? Uh, yeah, I'm doing well. Uh, I'm Steven. Um, I have never played the system either, but I have intrinsic trust in Tim. He and I have gamed together both uh, online and in person. Uh, so I am super excited and to play with uh, Tommy again and a couple new folks. So super stoked. All right. And Mark, last but not least. Hey, how's it going? Um... Yeah, so uh, on Discord, I'm um, Mark Samaneus. That's my online alias. Um, so uh, I've never played uh, Shadow of the Demon Lord before, but I've been doing D&D since 2019. All right. And, well, I've been playing D&D since, well, 1983. So. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I have a few years on you. <laughs> It'll be Christmas this year. It'll be 40 years, so. That's when I got the first blue and green box set as a kid. You do anything special? You uh, should. Normal Christmas stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe avoiding <laughs> the family. But all right. We're going to move right on into the game then. So there's no delays. Our group has been traveling with a caravan for the last few days on its way to... Uh, of course, I didn't open up the character sh the module yet. Um, tells you how prepared I was worrying about the technical stuff and not the actual game stuff. Give me just a moment. Forest Reach, I believe, is what it's called. Quick. Fletcher's Rest. Excuse me. Not even close. <laughs> I'm heading towards Fletcher's Rest. They've been traveling multiple days out of crossings, which is a major city in the area. The caravan is filled with merchants and quite a few pilgrims on its way to Fletcher's Rest for a ceremony to the cult of the new god. And for one reason or another, the party members are accompanying this caravan either to go through town or for being there for 
Ah. Why can't I find it suddenly? Uh, too many things open. I apologize. Tails. Take your time, Tim. Oh, no, I just... First... <laughs> A bunch of first time things happening so well, no i closed everything up to restart the machine before the game so i know everything was fresh and nothing and i closed things i didn't open things because i was more worried about getting our stuff hooked up obs wise okay the characters are traveling with a caravan to fletcher's reach they're going through the old woods now and if we're progressing this is about your third day out what have you guys been doing the last three days traveling? You've gotten to know each other a little bit, maybe. Anything worth noting? Why don't we start with Bile? What ha what do you look like, and what have you been doing the last three or four days out of crossings with the group? Traveling. Well, Bile is a goblin, first of all. And the thing that everybody would probably notice first is... You know, if there weren't already very unsettling things around in this world, it might be a little more disconcerting that his eyes never blink. His sickly yellow eyes are constantly looking out into the world, pupilless. So it's kind of hard to tell if he's actually looking at you or not. And really, the only way that you ever know that he's awake and not sleeping is if you see his... Uh, tail that has a tip on it that almost looks insectoid with a couple antenna on it and he is usually uh, playing with uh, a few of his cockroach friends that run from shoulder to shoulder and and hide in his cap um, uh, with his little insectoid tail and he's uh, been mostly keeping to himself he's on his way to never fall by way of Fletcher's rest to attend the funeral of his seventh eldest brother, Snot, who, as some sick joke, gave all of his siblings his cold before he uh, passed away. So uh, if you see me sniffling and coughing, it's from my dumbass brother, Snot. Yes. All right. And what you have been what have you been doing the rest of the i mean have you been hanging out with the people avoiding them getting to know anybody the main one that i'm concerned about is this clockwork fella that's over in one area you see if i weren't already sick being anywhere near iron kind of makes my skin crawl so i've been mostly keeping to myself and uh drawing when we stop figures in the uh, you may have seen him kind of it almost looks like uh, schematics of some sort uh, in the dirt wherever we've uh, stopped for rest okay and speaking of the clockwork unit mm -hmm. 50 tell us about yourself what you've been doing on this trip why are you headed where you're going so, um, Unit 58, somewhat compact clockwork, only standing about four foot tall. Um, their build is far from elegant, but sturdy. Um, the smaller areas on them are indeed made of iron, and the larger areas appear to be made of brass. The metal is worn and has lost a lot of its luster but still appears to be very well built. Um, you would have noticed that if you had gotten close to Unit 58 during this time, that on the side of their torso, there is an engravement that states, if exploded, return to Marcel Oli. They come off as kind of aloof and drift off once in a while, or most of the time. They have a cog on the top of their head that splints slower as they drift. Most of the travel Unit 58 would have been spending watching the land pass by and drifting away from the present, um, snapping to attention when talked to. The cog will sputter and spin faster. Along the trip, uh, Unit 58 would have shared that they didn't know why they were exactly being sent to Fletcher's Rest, 
but they do as their creator says in hopes that this time they won't explode. Oh, yeah, Unit 58 would have shared that they have a history of exploding and they hope that it won't be a problem for anyone. Okay. And then amongst it, we also have two humans that are with the our foursome here. And we will start with Zachariah. Ah, uh, yes. Uh, yes, uh, my name is Zachariah Atherton. I'm um, I'm a I'm a human, and uh, you know um, I've uh, and uh, I've I've um, I have an I have um, I have an interest in uh, in in learning magic, and uh, I've and uh, and I took um, and uh, basically basically uh, I'm trying. And uh, basically, I, I, um, I took, I got on the caravan, caravan to Fletcher's Rest to uh, start to start my traveling, since uh, I know that I'm not gonna like, uh, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna get where I am, you know, laying around in my town. My, uh, my, the description is my character. Uh, um, I'm, I'm wearing uh, these black robes, got this Alburn hair, and I, and you can. And uh, my and my eyes, um, you know, glinting with a uh, uh, they glint with a um, with a kind with a kind of um, with a with a with the same Alburn color. And I try to keep and I'm like spending the whole time keeping to myself, not a uh, not a uh, you know, not wanting to not anyone not wanting anyone to get into my face. <laughs> okay. As I, as I said earlier, the caravan is made up of a mix of families going to the various locations, merchants traveling along. Basically, you're traveling as a group along for supposed safety and numbers. It's about your getting about three in the afternoon, four in the afternoon of your fourth day. You're into the woods now. It's dark overcast the canopy is lots of long shadows sunlight it's hard to see though a couple of you do have some shadow vision as you guys are getting ready to make camp because there's such a large number of you you are suddenly attacked by a large group of bandits all of you scatter trying to get away. Some of the guards tell you, run to the woods, we'll call you when it's safe. Any of you, all of you, I'm assuming are going to listen. And one guard is trying to push you away and stand between you and these attackers because he was you were near him. And he's going to try to get you to hide in the woods with him. Are they going to follow? Yeah. You hear the bandit, you hear people screaming, Mommy, no! Bait, 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 as a dog gets kicked. Dad! As you hear somebody, the wet, sticky sound of a sword going through somebody. You hear laughing and screaming. Lots of men in chaos running around. Grab the kids. They're worth more money. Don't worry about the men. The women are actually worth are much worth. More of them worth much more. If you can keep the men, we can sell them for labor. And so forth and so on. Things you see, the screaming. But they get less and less as you move deeper in the woods. Some people are following you. So, oh, there goes some. Go get them. And the guard who was following you says, you guys go. Run ahead. I'll try to hold them back. Or at least lead them this way. And he points. Suddenly, you guys are running in the woods and are alone. It's been maybe half hour, 45 minutes, maybe even an hour. You don't know. You've been running and hiding and looking back. You found a small little clearing to take a moment's rest. And here you are. 
you're not exactly sure anymore which way you ran because of the way the twist and turns and going around big trees and down little ravines and through the terrain. Any of you got any sort of background for Outland? Our woodsman? I'm a chimney sweep man. <laughs> <laughs> so I here you not. guys are. You found a small clearing. You got a moment's rest. A moment to decide and talk. You were on your way to... Uh, dang it, I keep scrolling. Fletcher's Reach. And you know it's probably only about another... Well four hours on the road, maybe five that it was going to be. You were hoping to get there tomorrow morning early. But all you know is that the road you were going north. Uh, Bile is uh, counting um, some things and then uh, he uh, Nicole, right? It's Nicole. Nicole with the uh, Q. Nicole with the Q. Um, sees this uh, this uh, goblin man run up uh, with his head kind of down at the ground and be like, oh my god, famine, I thought you were gone. And you see it at, at your feet, like just where you were about to step uh, was is this little cockroach and he quickly swipes it up with like these long fingers and looks up at you. And, uh, so what what does uh, what, what uh, Bile see uh, from this human that's just run? Okay. Like, what, what, what does the cold look like? <laughs> oh, I sorry, I skipped somebody. I apologize. <laughs> it's fine. So Nicole looks uh very much like this, uh very human, quite tall for a woman, uh dressed in simple black vestments with probably the cult of New God. Like it's very generic sort of affair, so you're not really sure, but it might be, given where we're going. And when we're at the caravan, she was she's been highly social, very friendly, but also not the most helpful person. Like she's the type that talks a lot, but you don't really learn much about her, and also it's not relevant to what's going on. So she looks down at him, she's just she froze when he ran over to her as if he was about to attack her, but then saw it's a roach. Yeah. And she just kind of stays frozen and just kind of looks around to see if there's any other bugs just around. No, no, I got them all. Don't worry. I, this is the last one I was missing. Uh, are you, you sure? Gotta... How do you keep track of them? Um, I just count them all. I got nine. And he holds up nine fingers. He only has nine fingers. What happened to your hand? Well, a story for a later time. What the fuck happened back there? Oh, uh, bandits. It's not a new affair, but don't like any time each time it happens. Better than those fucking crazy demons that have been around, I guess. Yeah. They're very, they're, they looked mostly uh not demonic so should be fine <coughs> unit 85 or 50 yeah 58 what are you doing there also since you came running in clanking cluttering you just hear um under their breaches oh shoot oh shoot oh shoot <laughs> and um they're kind of just in their own panic. Um, staying away from the the pair, the goblin specifically, kind of maybe picked up on a vibe that they weren't necessarily wanted <laughs> around them. Though they are extremely curious about these cockroaches and watch them kind of sputter around. Okay. Zachariah? Zachariah, excuse me. I keep wanting to call you Zach. And... It's okay. You can call me Zach. Um, <clears throat> oh, yeah. So, um, 
Hmm. Uh, okay, sorry. Um, yeah, so uh, I'm. So yeah, I managed to run away. I managed to run away from these from the bandits, and I'm um, and I'm with you guys, and uh, and uh, I'm in I'm in agreement. There's gonna be a there, there's safety in numbers, since I'm uh, <laughs> since I'm not since I'm not since I'm not even a not, since I'm not even a novice yet. A novice of what? Novice level. He's yeah. He's a, no, he's a very novice mage. What? Yeah. Uh. Turn these up. Mar uh, Zach, she asked you a question. Are you going to answer? Oh, uh, sorry. Uh, what was your question? A novice of what? <clears throat> oh, yeah. I'm, I'm sim. Yeah, I'm, I'm basically, yeah, I'm not, um, I'm not. I'm not very skilled at magic yet, and uh, it's like I only got. I only got one spell on me. <laughs> oh, so you're learning. Yeah. Uh, is it a useful spell? Oh yeah. Uh, got my hands on a. Got my got my hands on a good electricity spell. Can it set fires? Oh, it's the uh, yeah, it's the shock spell. I don't know what that is. Oh yeah, it's a yeah, it's an offensive spell. Um, you know, if I if I if, I, if uh, in the in the off chance someone uh, anyone attacked me, I could just uh, you know. But you know, of course, I you know can't take care of a whole bandit horde. Uh, well, it's useful if uh, any of the bandits show up again. We should go. I don't, are we supposed to stay here? I'm gonna get to the nearest fucking town. I don't know about yeah. the rest of you. Oh yeah, me too. Are there others we with us, go. or is it just the four of us? At this moment, there's only the four of you there. You saw others scattering to the woods, but that you might run across them if one of you dies. And <laughs> um, he, uh, uh, Biles is definitely just eyes peeled back toward where they were and it is much darker now that you're not by the road and having the kind of the canopy was cracked a little bit there to let light in it's much darker here your your shadow vision definitely is coming in handy here for you bile so does is there can he see any sort of a a path that seems easier to roll through um He's heard this metal machine clanking behind him and wants to try to. You can look for one, but there's really, you don't have no. I no, mean, I don't, I... You, you've, there's really not much more paths, more like little ravines, maybe some places where some animals may have walked through that are slightly thinner, but you're not sure even really because of the. This is an old woods. The trees are huge, the roots are all over the place. I mean, there is an atmosphere that just feels ancient in some of this area. Well, he's a pretty small fellow, so he's feeling particularly small. Yeah. I mean, this is the old, not called the old woods for nothing. Are any of your living bodies tired from the fleeing? What kind of fucking crazy question is that? <laughs> <laughs> he like kind of like steps back. <clears throat> yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure plenty of us frantically ran for our lives from a whole bandit horde. So, are they tired? <laughs> they are. They are tired. We, we're tired. Yes. I'm recovering. Can we keep moving? We, we should, should keep, keep moving. moving. What direction are we? What? Where are we? Does anyone know? Has anyone navigated woods before? Nope. No. I all think we right. lost track. Ah, so we're all from the cities. Fine. Great. Wonderful. <laughs> all right. Uh, you generally know that the road was going north and that there's a town and community up there. 
Now, there are actual rules for this. So if anybody wants to try to choose a direction to go, somebody can take the lead and they can make a intelligence roll. Vile feels pretty confident. He oh, okay. looks around at everybody. Um, I, I, you guys can see right or you guys can't see shit here. Yep. You will make an intelligence challenge roll with two Bane minus one for every outdoor wilderness profession you, you may have. So since none of you have it. Nope. All right. It says a d20. Yep, just roll a one d a d20 with two banes. So you'll roll two six sided dice on. Just put two banes when it asks you. Okay. How do you want me to do that? Okay. Let me. I I have to look at the character sheet myself. Just a second. Or do you just want me to like type it in as the slash r? I'm surprised there isn't a button to hit for intelligence roll. You can't just click it. I'll try. I clicked it. It did not. Hey, learning the if character you click sheet. The, isn't... If you click the modifier next to it, it'll let you. Oh, oh. You click the modifier. Oh, oh, yeah. okay. oh and two, Thank two you. banes. Number. Uh, and then do I put a input value? Just put two. Minus... Eh? Eh. Eh? That was a no. plus. That was a plus, but we will. So you would well, still. Have... Have it would have been so a minus a ten, one. I, you should have I put roll, a minus. What did I roll? What it what oh, it thought, you, Yeah, it was. It should put a negative in there for a bane. Okay. I'll but that. that's fine. You rolled a one. Right. We'll just subtract it instead of adding it. So you okay. still succeeded. Because you rolled a you rolled a twelve. Oh, excuse me. I rolled a 10. 10 plus 2. I have a plus one. I have a plus 1 to intellect. Okay. And the higher of those two was a 2, so it would be a 9. Oh, then you would have failed. Sorry. Yeah. It's definitely <laughs> this way. I can roll intelligence if you like. You we don't know where we lost yet. Pull speed ahead. You can say, no, this way. <laughs> Okay, so that's fine. We just, uh, there is a rules. They got the rules written here. Just let me close the sheet. Sweet. And have to figure out where all the tools are. Reveal area. You move ahead one hex. You guys should see the map on roll 20. Okay. I'm not going to show it. Sweet. Is there, a map? there it is. Pop that out. There we are. So this um, <clears throat> so this hexagon next to next to a square. That's where we are. The hexagon is where you started with the star, and then I moved you, and then you he rolled, and you you. Progress to that next hex. Each hex is a mile. Gotcha. It's this way, guys. <laughs> Instead of going north like he thought, he went either north one east. right or one left. Northwest. Slightly off. He kind of knows the direction, but he was a little off. So we should and, slip and... Her away from the bandit. Yep. Bile so, definitely. Uh, takes a path that is more suited for his size. So anybody that's larger than a, I, he's a half size on here. I'm a one half size. Uh, so okay. anybody larger than that is like getting flicked by branches and stuff. <laughs> okay. Um, who's leading? Bile is definitely yeah. leading. Bile, roll a 1d6. Got it. Four. 
Okay. Have you guys managed to travel through that hex without any issue? Or for about a mile, you don't really see anything and you're headed. But you need to figure out which direction you might need to head. You kind of lost your bearings a little bit going through some of these twists and turns and around the trees and through some ravine areas because this is slightly rough, rocky area. We're in the foothill regions below the Black Hills, which are known for their coal. So you'll need to roll another 1d20 minus 2 this time, Steve. Okay. For your intellect. So, so I'll roll that and then put a minus 2 in? Yep. Oh, whoops. And what it does is it takes the higher of the number and applies it. So you don't apply both of them. No. What did I roll? I rolled an eight. You swear you're going north. <laughs> After a while, uh, he's you just hear him start it's talking to himself. It's getting darker. It is getting darker. I mean, it was already four, three, four o'clock in the afternoon when this happened. We're now five, six o'clock. So it's starting to get darker as the sun goes down. It's probably been four, three, four hours since you were supposed to make camp and eat. So I'm just putting these thoughts in your guys' head. We're definitely close to a road by now. And he he like kind of like you, you see where the little cockroaches come out. He's like, no, princess, I'm telling you, I know which way I'm going. <laughs> do they do they speak? You can't hear it. No. Well, you must not be special then. Oh, okay. We'll Do you want special. to take a rest and have someone else uh, lead the way? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I, I, I'm fucking lost, guys. <laughs> it, it's okay. <laughs> Maybe we we haven't been. At least we haven't found them yet, or they haven't found us yet. So, further away is probably better. Yes. I, I mean, can can any of you guys see? I, I'm like I heard that like humans can't really see in the dark, and I don't know what you are, Stephen. <laughs> since we're still in that mile, and you were leading, please mm -hmm. roll a one d six. You got it. You'd be right. Humans can't really see that well in the dark, but we could, I guess, well, torches would be a bad idea. I right. wasn't made to see in the dark. Bye. Ooh, ooh. We, you see a bear in the distance, Stephen, but it's not near you, but you do see one. <clears throat> Yeah, a fire is definitely not a good idea. And right now, I don't even think that food is a good idea. Because there's a fucking bear out there. At where? And he just points a, a, a absurdly long finger out in one direction. <laughs> so... And you can no longer see it from... Or if they would look now, it's like lost in behind trees. You they couldn't see it. But you sure that was a big brown... Bear. So the bear has moved from where he saw it as well? Well, he saw it. It was like walking further away, but he saw a bear. I mean, I'm you're hearing birds and other animals running around. I mean, I mean they're all I'm... there. It's just they're not bothering you. That was probably one of the bigger predators you've seen. Well, if we can't make camp by the bear... Are we going to try to move again? Should, I don't think we should make camp at all. 
but also you can't see, well someone else try to figure out a direction and we could just use your eyes just make sure we don't run into anything like bears yeah i can scout or if you want me to i i thought we'd run into the road by now Well, we'll give you a rest. Who else wants to try? Can any of us see far enough? To try. Basically, in the system here, you, uh, darkness is going to give cover to some things and how far you can see for ranges and stuff, but it's not that dark yet. We're talking... It's getting darker, but you could probably see 20, 30 feet in front of you in the woods. It's, so it's not that bad. And you probably I, see further, but I'm just saying the sun is going down. You have to, you should start thinking about this stuff. I could give it a go. Go ahead. I could give it a go. Go ahead. My two bane. You may roll if you want to try to lead. You can roll an intelligence check with two. Of bands. minus two. Okay, minus two. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Where's my navigation? Yeah. <laughs> you. Oh, you've been going the wrong direction. You tell them. We should be going this way. Okay. <laughs> the map's not showing on um the sh the stream. I'm aware of that. They don't really. <laughs> I mean, I can show it gotcha. if you want here. It's probably like, no. Uh, that was a one. Yeah. That was rolled. <laughs> yeah, that was indeed a one. <laughs> I, I plan on pu putting that on screen when we do a combat or something. Not when we just walk through. You know, this map. This is for you to kind of get an idea. Gotcha. So, um, as you're leading the way, uh, I'm not going to call you Minnie. Francesca. <laughs> uh, roll a 1d6, please. Okay. Five. Well, you, you guys managed to make enough noise or sounds to scare away anything too dangerous at this time. It's just the creaking and clunking of metal. <laughs> But you made it through that, Maya. Yeah. You want to continue leading? You know where you're going. For sure. Yeah, I'll, I'll try one more time. We'll keep going. Oh, oh my Another God. One. That was once Another again a one. one. Wow. Oh, a five I, minus a I five. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> that I, wow. My intellect. And people thought I bad. was bad. <laughs> it's because you commented on having my roles in the beginning. <laughs> Definitely this way. She's at unit 58. <laughs> Not me. Unit 58. Gonna... It's just like clunking through the path. Again, it's going to be a smaller path that's taken. Anyone taller than half foot is probably going to get hit because that's what Goblin, the, uh, what Bile did. Um, except now they're like also breaking things as they walk through it. And the snapping of twigs and the stomping of ground, yeah. Yep. Being <clears throat> subtle and stealthy, I see it. Yeah, super subtle. Does anyone how's, your, how, how's your key turning, by the way, Minnie? Excuse me, I did it again. French, uh, <laughs> unit 58. I I literally unit 58. Um, it's been a it's been a year in the making of you calling me Minnie. So. Yeah, I, we play in our Zoihander game together every Sunday, and so I've been calling <laughs> her that character name for over a year. So, I apologize. <laughs> 
So the key is uh, the key's turning. Okay. Turning pretty normally. Just keeping the. I need to keep in touch. Are you still going to lead? Is somebody else going to speak up? Uh, yeah. I, I, you're, I will you know you're going the right way. Just ask. It me. Up. Yep. <laughs> Confidently ripping through this forest. Probably want to be careful um, with the, the noise. And oh, if someone finds us. Oh. Okay. And then if unit is just going to move even slower. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's clunk. Much slower <laughs> clunking. <laughs> yes. That's not what I meant. Is that better? <laughs> no. No, it's not. Oh. I'm not used to this body. Um, it's just going to try to be lighter. But still Are you used to another body? I'm not really used to anybody. It's philosophical. <laughs> Does should I keep going? I mean, you're. I think you're doing a good job. I don't know. I just know there's a lot of noise, and I'm scared that somebody's going to show up. Can, um, as a leading, can I also try to roll like an agility or stealth or something? Like agility, I think is what it would be to be quieter. Or, um, what are your professions? I'm not proficient in any of that. <laughs> then you can attempt it, but um, it'll be at a minus one bane. It's, yeah, it's not going to be great. Okay, we'll see how I can do this. It's like loading. Hmm, it didn't go through. <coughs> yeah, I minus made three. three. She falls down a ravine. Clank, 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 clink. It takes no why, damage. Why don't one of you try? Are you okay? I'm gonna like you check rolled a negative over. three for people. <laughs> I'm gonna check myself over. Do I appear operational? I'm guessing. You did not take any more damage than scuffing and scraping due to your high armor. I mean, excuse me, defense. I appear operational. And I'm going to try to get back up out of that ravine. There's some twigs and branches and clumps of dirt hanging off of you, grass. Um, there, There is a thing. So if uh, your key stops turning, yep. uh, if you roll less than a zero on a challenge roll. Oh, really? I missed that. Yeah. You, she's stopped at the <laughs> bottom. of. She's okay. <laughs> I, <laughs> Great. Thank you, Steven. I mean, a new race. I looked at the clockwork. It's really cool. Okay. It's awesome stuff. All right. Oh, yeah. Mini, yeah. excuse me. Unit 58 is now at the bottom of the ravine. <laughs> Not really a ravine. I mean, it's a small ledge. I mean, there's probably about uh, uh, six feet down, five to six feet down, but she's stopped. She's there. Bio like looks over. Like she now is in her object a, form into a pit. We're like, you know, a bottomless pit, like waiting for like the last sound. Uh, <laughs> I, I think maybe they they they're broke. <laughs> I don't I don't hear. Do you think that they'd scream? Hello, hello. Are you okay? No response. Shit. Unless something ate, well, no, thing no, like no, there's metal? nothing down there. I don't see it's just like laying there, kind of motionless. Oh. Cool. So, who's gonna go down there? Not me. I get fucking sick and sniffly every time I'm even near it. My skin crawls right now. You're just looking at it. 
backs up a little bit. Uh, yeah, oh, yeah, I don't know. He tosses, he tosses a rope. I think I have rope. I think I'll quite a, several of you do, so I'm not too worried yeah. about it. He tosses like a rope at you guys. Literally, it's only like a five foot drop, maybe six foot. It's not like a ravine of 20 feet down, you know. It's basically she walked through a bush area and it was like, ah, boom, 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 boom. So it's like just double my height. You would definitely need, yeah, a rope. yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm just so you don't think it's a deep, like, 20-foot crevice or something. Wendy, Wendy, would you like me to roll the D6 for my family? I'm giving him a chance to understand. Okay. To give him. Is she, I Explodes did put up the. Yeah, roll the a first. one. <laughs> hey, Zachariah, so, how good are you at picking up heavy metal? Well, um, it's not. It's not something of my. Um, it's uh, It's not something I've. Back, I've usually. I usually do, but um, I'm will. I'm willing to go down there and help. Clockwork are not an unknown race, so I mean things about them. They've been used in the military and um, industry for years, so it's not like people are unfamiliar with them. Basically, you can tell from where you're standing. Her key stopped turning. And and uh, unit fifty eight is half size and it's about 75 pounds all right yeah i got i got no problem getting down going down there and helping him helping unit unit 58 out i just don't go i've uh, i just never got, gone around uh you know helping them out helping them out when they're like on their backs like turtles and I mean, you can get down there. I mean, is somebody going to just leave her sit there so we have to roll for if she explodes just for the fun of it? I mean, I'm well, fine. With so it. it's only it's <laughs> only the D six if you become an object from becoming incapacitated. Yep. Yeah. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not incapacitated. I'm not. I didn't say I was unwilling. I'm. I'm. Uh, you know. Okay. I'm I, just gonna. I understand, Stephen. So, yeah. just so you know. I think you just turned the key. Those things are weird. Okay. Yeah. Easy enough. So you know, just you, you know, I'm just like. So I'm just like. Uh, okay. So so I'm gonna do a. Um, do I roll for searching investigation? Yeah. Oh, that's where it is. The incapacitated words. Subtle words. Yep. So she's. Uh, if you just. Bit. Yep. Just get down there and turn the key. She should start right back up. All right, so I get, to... yep. So I get, so I get my butt down there and and help unit unit fifty eight out and turn that key. Where is your key, by the way, unit fifty eight? It is on unit's back, like between where some shoulder blades would be. Okay, so a fairly typical spot right in the back. So. All right, so yeah, I'll go ahead and wind. I'll go I'll go ahead and wind them up like a clock. <laughs> you find yourself face down in a pile of dirt, slightly mud, moss, as you come as you. to Unit Fifty Eight. Shoot, just gonna push up. My apologies, and just gonna look at how far. That they fell. You're maybe right? some, maybe someone else should do a go. I'll do it. <laughs> they're, they're just gonna crawl up this ravine. Oh, so what happened? Oh. I didn't, I didn't succeed. What was that? Hmm? I didn't succeed or something. No, you succeeded at turning your key and everything. So, I didn't know you attempted unit, anything beyond that. Unit is awakened. Doesn't take much. You just have to be able to reach her and say you turned your key. So. Awesome. But she's now she's now activated again. I'll take the lead. I wish we could <laughs> use lights. You got uh, many of you got torches. Yeah, but don't want to attract attention. 
Doesn't fire keep animals away? Doesn't keep people not away? Bandits. Who want to <laughs> steal stingers things? You guys have not heard any other sounds but animals and wildlife for a while. I'm just saying. You guys... We're paranoid. I, I have no Miles problem is just with not going to bring it up because he can see in the dark. He's mm -hmm. not even thinking about using torches. Do we feel safe enough to start using fire? Uh, he gives a listen. I mean, I don't hear screaming, but that's never a guarantee. Blows his nose. Fellow human who also cannot see in the dark, are you okay with uh, lighting a fire? <clears throat> right. You're speaking to moi? Yes. Yes. Um, yes, Zachariah um, would totally love to have a door. Would totally love to have a torch. All right, then. Uh, I guess we're going to light a torch. So we can actually see where we're going. And then I'll take the lead. All right. Uh, torch will, I didn't look up specifics, but say about an hour or so. So go ahead and roll an intelligence roll. Intelligence. That is the wrong page. This is my sheet. At a minus two bane. Or a minus two when they ask beans or wounds. Minus two. All right. We are terrible. It's a nine. And what was your goal here? Just so I know which direction I should be aiming you. Uh, find north and go that way. All right. Suddenly, you're running along a river, or a little stream, actually. Huh. Do we know which way the river runs? <laughs> it is currently it like running south. South to west. Well, excuse me. It is running downward on the map. <laughs> Your north and south are screwed up. <laughs> So that's promising. There's a river. Uh, I, I shouldn't call it a river, more of a, a stream, sl slightly bigger than a stream. Rivulet. Yep. Should I roll another die for a thing? You will need to roll a 1d6 as you're walk, uh, headed across this. This is taking about an hour. You've traveled one, two, three, four. You've been traveling about five hours now. It is getting pretty dark. So far, nobody's rolled one. You're doing fine. All right, still have men. It's all to get. Fantastic. Or hit one of the special squares or hexes. <laughs> so you're close. All right, well, you seem to know what you're doing. Hey, this looks right. I mean, I found a river. There's some fresh water. water. Well, die of dehydration. Yeah. That, that's good. So I'll keep on I looking. Uh, Want me to roll again? Um, yeah, go, go ahead. It. Unless somebody else wants to speak up. Yay. Like I said, this is kind of a hex crawl until you guys roll some. Woohoo! 13. All right. <laughs> oh, it's like, damn, I we've been headed the wrong direction altogether. Uh -huh. You finally found north, at least this time. It has definitely gotten darker. I'm not willing to stop. I, I'm just Tired, letting you know. I don't want to. We have torches, so we should be able to we go. Do. But okay, uh, one of you an hour? remove a torch. Okay. I'll do it. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Light another one. 
I can light one. I have two. I know several of you have two, so. You, you're damn sure side. that was north and that you guys have been going all over the place. You finally found some moth on the north side that you recognized for whatever reason. Some wives' tale you held, heard once. Uh, so, guys, um, I think we've been going the wrong direction the entire time. Uh, now we're going north. <clears throat> nothing ventured, nothing gained. <sighs> Great. Now, I want you to think about this. I mean, have you ever seen a terrain of an... This is a slightly rugged... I live in an area where this is kind of like this in the woods where rocks and ravines and you're getting twisted and turned. And these are old, large woods. So it's easy to kind of lose direction. So you're doing great now, but just if you do something wrong, you know that might happen. But now roll a 1d6. I did. I got a five again. Ooh, excellent. You're ahead of me. You heard something in the distance and you told everybody to stop. You waited for a while. Look around. Everything looks okay. You don't see anything right now, but you know you heard something. In the distance, you guys are hearing wolves and other animals. Night owls. I mean, it's getting interesting. Creaking of the wood as the wind blows through, making all sorts of scary noises. Or You guys are from the city. You're not from the woods. This stuff is not... I mean, you guys should be on a little edge. Once again, check with the group. Going to keep going or are we going to stop? I want to keep going because I don't want to be here. But this is uh, and the bears and things. I appear to be fine. Well, you're a machine. You're I'm, de go I'm definitely all right. All right. Sounds like we're going still. So. I mean, excellent. Roll. And it's two. Spit. No. Oh. Mm -hmm. That was a three. <laughs> Not a problem. You know you're going north yet. It's a four. Not really finding anything. I mean... You don't notice any no encounters. How about that? Have another drink, Kim. You guys are moving along fine. Um, how are you all doing? I don't really hear any chitter chatter or anything. I mean I just making sure uh, I'm giving you an opportunity to put your input instead of just dice rolling here. Once the uh, the the fire is lit. Um, uh, bile uh, starts to just kind of skirt along the, the edges of the light um, kind of as we're, we're moving and, and kind of testing the, the, the edges both the head and behind and uh, kind of walking back and forth like you know running up to the front kind of peeking and then running to the back and peeking and he's a little bit manic at this point you're not noticing being followed or anything like that if that's what you're worried about as you're manicking around. Anybody else doing anything worth note? Or I should... Uh, unit, with... unit 58 is probably keeping their head down at this point. Little flustered from having their key stop. So... Suddenly, okay, them a bit too much of some other instances where they've been left with the key stopped. Uh, uh unit 58, you had said that uh, that unit 58 had a, a penchant for exploding, and like everybody knew that on in the caravan, yes, okay. 
So you're not going to like <clears throat> explode suddenly when you stop like that? Or is that like what happens? Only sometimes. Only sometimes. Only sometimes. Great. Warm, fuzzy <laughs> feeling right there. So you've exploded before? Yeah, quite a few times. And you just get put back together or? My creator tends to search for my soul again and put it into a new body. Uh, Sounds uh, worse than my uh, dad. <laughs> It is a bit jarring. Does your dad rip souls as well? <clears throat> I don't think so. Uh, I've never heard that of him, but you know, being the seventeenth son, you know, you don't get a lot of face time with the old man. Fair. All right, as you guys, I mean, you're talking as you move along. If anybody else wants to make a roll, I mean, Nicole is definitely oh. knows what way is north. An intelligence roll. If you want to try, I mean, you can speak up. All right, I will. I will do that. Okay. Minus two. Minus two, Bane. Does nobody has a wilderness a profession? <laughs> 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 we knew what oh, we were right. getting into. Hey, oh, nice. All right, suddenly you know you're going the right direction. Um, as you're traveling along, once again, it's you guys are just managing to miss some of the places. <laughs> Getting We're to roll dodging. when you need to. Yeah. I might throw one in anyway. <laughs> I mean, roll 1d6. Yep, go ahead and roll 1d6 so you'll be an encounter. But as you travel along, it's the basic. It's getting a little... As you get over this way, you're seeing some signs of maybe some old paths. I mean, looks like there may have been one time some old roads or something back here because you're seeing what looks like an old cobblestone little area coming through this hex or general area of this hex. Not much of one. If uh, but any our, of those stones are that, loose, uh, uh, Bile's going to uh, kind of pick at one with his uh, long fingers and, and add a, a stone or two to his... Uh, his pouch of stones. Okay, not a problem. I'm just letting you know that there's sign of some possible stuff around. I think we're getting close, guys. Yeah. Go ahead, Go ahead roll a one d six. Uh, is that correct? Oh, you want me to roll a 1d6? Yep, roll a 1, please. No, don't roll a 1, please. <laughs> okay. Uh, on a 1d6. Oh, there we go. Hi. <laughs> Dang it, guys. Five. Four, five, four, five. Uh, I think I'm going to have to, you know, GM adjust. <laughs> <laughs> All right, um, who wants to attempt to lead or continue to lead, Zach Zachariah? We have oh, yeah. Um, have it. Oh, you're, um, you're suggesting I take the lead? I'm asking yes. if you are. I'm not suggesting you are. I'm suggesting that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll, uh, I can take the lead. It's not a problem with me. Mine is exactly. Bane, please. Minus... Minus what? Just want to ask you for being boons or bane. Put minus two. 
I'm just reminding the rules. Okay. So you want me to you want me to roll again with a uh, with a minus two on boons? Yeah. A minus yeah, I wanted to ask. They just put a negative two in there. Okay. So uh, I make so you want me to make another intelligence check? Yep, another intelligence check with a minus two. I'm gonna ask you. Come on, we're gonna need some combat here sooner. Or I'm just gonna make it happen. <laughs> Dang it, oh, nice. he still knows north is north. Two in a row. Oops, a little too far. Control Z. Okay, progress is being made. You're only in this hex, so don't get too excited. Oh, Good no, thing. I'm, I'm only hex. slightly enthusiastic. <laughs> yep. 1d6 to see if we get attacked. Yep. Okay. Do you want me to roll a 1d6? Yes, it's a, for the random encounter. Okay. Four. <laughs> We've only rolled five and fours. Yeah. <laughs> you guys, please refresh all your pages. <laughs> <laughs> and then if you... We want to progress further. Things get a little more interesting anyway. You can try rolling it again. <clears throat> okay, another intelligence check. If you think uh, he should continue, you I mean, it's the party decision, not mine. Keep going. Absolutely. Okay. Okay. All right. Cool. Um, same thing. Minus two on the boons. Yep. Ah, man. Hey, yo. Nice. <laughs> As you move forward, you see... Nope, sorry. I was on the wrong thing. Uh, reveal area. As you move forward, you see the road. Or a clearly defined path. Large enough for a, a wagon or two to go past. Sweet. Wonderful. Bile runs up and, like, kisses the ground and, like, Hugs some of the dirt toward himself. Oh, the... <laughs> give him a fuck, whoever it is they that got us here. Thank you. Turns back to the human. Thank you. You had the way. Thank you, magical person. <laughs> Roll a one d six. Oh no! <laughs> Except for here it goes. There's oh! the one. There it is. I knew it. I knew it before it happened. Right at that moment. Look. We find the road and boom. <laughs> I didn't even have to look. Okay, let me read a couple seconds here. Mm -hmm. They're probably expecting people on the road. We were safer in the woods. Roll a wow. 1d6, please. Oh, excuse me. 1d4. Oh, okay. Three. Dang it, why didn't you keep them vertical? All right, I screwed something up earlier. Oh, no, I did. Uh, move the players. Just the play. Nice. Give me just a moment to set things up because it's a random amount. The map changed. And we will be jumping to the other screen. And I just have to open up the right button. There we go. Come on, go over. What did you roll? 
Three. Roll of, yep. Plus one. Excellent. Our first combat. You guys are um any all of you can roll a perception check. Sweet. Okay. All right. With any oh, I get a plus uh one or no wait. Never mind. I don't have any pluses for this. It's just this. No it's boons or bangs. Straight. straight right now because uh unless you were a Attempting to expect anything. Nah. Yay. Ooh, nice. 15, 14, 18. As you guys are coming up, you noticed... Um, oh, why can't I click on your icons? I'm on the wrong screen. How did I turn on one? Just did you yeah. did you put the Yeah, I turned on fog okay. of war somehow. I hit a control no key. Hey. <laughs> Here Off. come the good rolls. <laughs> Definitely on edge. You notice that there are bandits walking along the road. I'm trying to get a updated icon for one of you, second. Um, you have a moment to prepare since you notice them first. Tell me what you want. So Bio was just them. about to go hug the ground and then saw these guys. You can hear them talking, bragging about things they did earlier. You can go into your own detail in your head. There's no need to discuss some of them. So, um, do we wait for them to leave or do we just get rid of them now? And they're generally walking towards you. Immediately, I, Bile is going to try to hide in the bushes. Okay, give me just a moment. I'm trying to fix something, but yet, yeah, roll your stealth or sneaky. So, I have a uh, uh, one boon because I am sneaky. Fourteen. All right, you are currently hidden. Anybody else taking any actions? Hmm. I'm gonna also hide, but also take out a sling. For obvious, about to snipe them from hiding. Okay. Uh, should I pre should I click my agility modifier for stealth? Yes. Yep. Okay. There's an agility You're challenge. You're also gonna hide. What was that? You're also You're gonna also hide. hiding. Oh yes, definitely. Attempt to okay. Here. All right. Yeah. I keep forgetting I have sheets. I'm scared to even attempt to hide. Oh, I think it'll be funny. <laughs> Fine. Or just lay on the ground and just play dead. <laughs> just pretend that I'm an object. Um, okay. Yeah, if you fail the roll bad enough, you become an object. <laughs> yeah, and then right? I guess it's fine. Then you don't care. <laughs> <laughs> Um, so, yeah, I'll take out, I'm just going to hide. I'm going to try to hide. And, uh, is it minus anything, or is it just straight? For you, it's straight up agility okay. at this point. <laughs> That's my oh. third one. My third oh. one. So just, just lay there. <laughs> oh, man. Goes the high, clank, 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 clank. I just, like. She failed, but she did not roll a negative, so she does not turn off. Nope. Good. Oh, my goodness. You step oh, forward and clang right into the road. Okay, at least I'm away from them. Or right Just down fast. the ravine in front of them. Oh, um, 
Where's Nicole's icon? This is her. She doesn't have an actual picture I have yet. Okay. Oh, okay. Sure. <laughs> so, in uh, Unit 58? Unit 58 is... Yeah, he's fallen into the road. He, just on the edge of the road, she took a step too far trying to be stealthy. Nice. Tumble, tumble, tumble. I need to be covered in bubble wrap. Like, <laughs> we to fix that when we get to town. All right. Um, this system works a little different than any uh, other ones. Yep. So you guys get to decide if you're going to go fast or you're going to go slow for your initiative. And I have to figure out how to turn this on. What does that uh, mean? Bio is going to go fast. Okay. <clears throat> fast so and page, slow. What fast mean? Yeah, go ahead. It's on page forty-six yeah. um, of the uh, of the handbook. If you got that, have open, to go me. and stop and look. It means but, that like the fastest you can either move or use a an action. Or use an a, an action. And if you look on, I put it in there, and I a uh, quick reference for everybody to use in roll twenty. Okay. Thank you. That Jen. should give you what the list of actions. Are also if you look towards the second sheet, it'll tell you some special actions you can take for ranged and for melee attacks. You can do, uh, Francesca, this is similar to stuff we can do in Zweihander, yeah. And it costs banes to do these things, so you'll take a negative possibility to, but you can do special actions, anybody can do them. <clears throat> but I can't and, throw pepper in anyone's face. <laughs> uh, no, I cannot in this game. <laughs> pocket, <laughs> pocket sand. Pocket sand. Shishasha. Oh, Dale Gribble just R.I.P. Dale Gribble. Retreat. <laughs> so the question here is: Are you going to do fast or slow attack? Fast for me. Fast if you want to attack without moving or move without attacking. It means you go first, you go before everybody else. Um, Can you change if you're going to do fast or slow? Or is it like you're doing fast the entire time or slow the entire time? You're doing uh, for the round and as fast you do your action quick means you go before everybody else and then the anybody so else. It's, any... it's, this, it's just per round depending yeah. on if you're doing fast. Per round you can switch up. Okay. I will, I'll do fast this round. Okay, and uh, a slow it just means you can move and attack or do two actions basically, or right, one action and a movement, something like that. Well, since I failed myself, I'm assuming they've seen me, right? Um, it's yeah. You when you fail with a one, it's pretty much a given. Okay. That okay. Fast. What does it mean by short range? <laughs> But it's considered short, range, short range, also on that chart, I believe that's uh, five yards, which is approximately 30 feet. And okay. each one of these squares is a yard. Dang it. Okay, I guess I'll take a slow. <laughs> I guess I'll do slow, actually. Okay. You're the only one they see right now. Everybody else did succeed in their stealth as Rolls to hide, correct? Correct. Yeah. Mm hmm. Wait, everybody, they don't get a perception. Wait, check. you moved me a little bit. Let me see if I'm close. Yeah, to... I'm just was making sure that I can see. Yeah. Either yeah, way, so you're fine. still the same. I just moved you on the yeah. horizontal. They're five feet too far. Okay. It's fine. And you can, yeah. And they see you, but they can't get to you either. And let me double check on what they have. I have their sheets here. And we'll pull it off so not everybody can read it. All right. They see you there, and one of them, the first one up here, mm -hmm. He wasn't expecting you, I mean, just to be there, but he's quickly uns getting out his bow. This one over here, and he's going to do a slow action. 
Because they're trying to capture you. As far as you know, that's him giving away information. I so mean, they were do... capturing people in the yep. when we heard last. So, so who out of uh, the players, who's going to do fast? Or are you going to do slow? Are you going to hold your action for a trigger, such as they get in a certain range, etc.? I was going to hold to do a trigger. I'll hold and do a trigger. Okay. Fast. <laughs> fast. Okay. Tell me, you said you're holding. What is your trigger? Uh, when they come within. Where's them? Oh, I'm in the wrong thing. So, if they come somewhere here, where I could actually hit them with the sling. Okay. When they come within range, or when they is what I'm okay. When they come within range. All right. Um, Zachary, or Zachariah, excuse me. Yes. Um. Yes. Um. I'll take. Um. I'll take. I'll take it slow and. Um, and I guess I'll. And I guess my trigger is when they uh, come within. When um is when they are um, is when they are uh, ten feet of me. Okay. Now that's not necessarily slow, but that's a fast to be triggered on, an action. Oh. Okay. If you want to do a movement and then hold, I'd let you do that. But then you'd have to do stealth on your movement, not just hide where you are. Ah. Uh, okay, I can um, I can rescind that. Uh, I guess um, so um, so how do I uh, so how should I operate if I'm going slow? Well, slow means you can move and do some, do an attack or something. So if you're gonna move, then I would ask for a stealth. If you're trying to be sneaky, if you're trying to do a charge, that's something else. So you have to kind of tell me what your intent is. Hmm. Okay. Um, or if you're just going to sit there until they get in range, using uh, Tin Man as the bait, that's another option too. Okay, um, I can. Um, yeah, I do. Want, I do intend on running on being stationary. Okay. So yours would be the same. It sounds like what uh, uh, Nicole was going to use. Excuse me. Yeah. Just to confirm. So we're all on the same page. Uh, yeah. yeah. Sounds all right. good. All right. Uh, the rest of them are... These two up front are going to move up with the bows. Uh, wait. I was going to hold my action for yep. trigger. Yep. What was the trigger? I was assuming when they get um, close. When they got, with, yeah, when they got within range, I was going to use it to distract. And what is the range on that? It said short range, so I'm guessing 30. So they need to move forward five feet. Or okay. one of them does. Yeah, five feet. You hear <laughs> one of this guy here. You, stay, stand there. We're going to kill you. And he's got his bow pulled and ready. I mean, he's... he. You can't see in the dark real well, correct? So, humanoid in shape, human. Size, yeah. And uh, you really can't see the other one, but from behind, since these guys are, oh, they're going slow, and they're waiting, and you guys are all waiting for trigger actions. <laughs> they get. This guy's going to come forward. All right, we got you know. Try to keep them covered. Just, just go ahead and grab it. I don't know what we can get for something like that. Maybe scrap metal. Slowly moving forward as a you. Although the, these two definitely have bows. This one has pulled the club out. And this one has also moved forward with the club out. They're all within your trigger ranges, guys. So can you tell me what you're going to do as soon as they enter them? So is it the that fast goes first or triggered goes first? Fast goes so first. I apologize. Order. You should have okay. gone before, Steve. Oh, that's all right. Um, 
Um, <clears throat> you can move he, or an attack. That's to your yep, choice. So he's gonna other. he's gonna just jet through the trees. Uh, one, two, three, four. There we go. Wait, no, I can't click my guy. No, nope. can't okay. move your guy. No, nope. sorry. Uh, he's gonna go like here. You don't have control of your token, or are you just on the wrong thing because you were on your measure I, icon? I don't have control of my token. Well, let me fix that. I think it's because I didn't drag him over. Same, I also don't have control. So if you just delete my guy, I'll drag him over. You should have oh uh, name player. Yeah, you should have edit and controlled by. That's strange. Yeah, it's Regardless. because I, I've had this happen I before. Can't move it's because you dragged game. over the icon, or it's because yeah. you dragged over the token. We so need if, to drag if I drag over. it over, then it'll it'll let me control it. That's fine. Drag over. Cool. You were over here somewhere. Oh, maybe. Can I? Oh, there we go. I think you were a little here. north. You were about here. Yeah. All right. So, yeah, he's going to go one, two, three, four, five, six. Like uh, here. Are you trying to be stealthy? Or are you charging ahead without oh, absolutely any... trying to be stealthy, if he can be. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me double check something because I have been oh, reading. Where's the other tokens? Oh, uh, you'll have to move your token on because I you have to do it. Otherwise, you had I have you don't have control. It Let's seems. See. Okay. I don't know why. So I'll just grab your character and drag him over. Right. He was Jen. Tell he me, was... I think you just grabbed victim five or six. Uh, he was. She was on four, so she has her name. She oh, should be able to four. see it. I will need a stealth roll from you at minus two, Bane, if you're trying to move it as quickly and as far at full speed. I do get plus one from Sneaky, so is it just minus one, Bane? Minus one, Bane, then. Cool. Agility, minus one. Submit. Two! Two! <laughs> They hear you. What the hell? And he, this one, this guy starts moving into the woods. Hey, there's another one. He says, fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> and these two heads start heading towards you because they notice you. Oh, they turn. Excuse me. I'm just, I shouldn't move them. They just turn. And um, I got to put you guys back in the turn order. And then some held action or some uh, triggers should go. Yep. I just need, I'm missing a Tommy token. Yeah. How do I drag? Just somewhere? grab your name and just drag it onto the map. Ah. Or your character name, excuse me, whatever it is. Select so move? Yes. There we are. Sweet. And you were somewhere over. Yeah. You were closer. And I don't think you were right there, but you close enough. Yeah. And let's move. He was, Steven was fast. Bless you. Thank you. So you guys can attack anybody, those who are on triggered. Okay. And that would have been you three. Do we have a turn order or just? Uh, whoever wants to go. There's not specific for you three. You guys go before the bandits. 
Cool. I'll shoot this one. All right. Roll your sling Slime. thing. Can I just click it? Let's see. You should click. be able to click the little. Is there a plus or minus? Uh, on Is... this, no, currently, no, unless you got any reason you think you could have use one of your professions or something you might have to use it. Straight up uh, roll. Probably not. <laughs> Boop. Oh. Oh, you hit that one good. The twenty. Yep. With two damage. Okay. Smacked him straight in the head. Which one was it? That was the one closest to you. This one. Yep. Okay. So just out from the woods. Yep. What did you hit him with? Just make sure. It was a sling. sling. So it was a little, right. little walk and just went pop. Hits him. Yep. Not much damage, you would think, but he's at 10 hit points. Oh. Now. It's one fifth of it. And we all seem about the same strength. All right, that was one, uh, Zachary. Or Zachary, yeah. Yeah. your okay. attack, you're on hold, or unless. Oh, um, so, um, question, um, uh, what, um, what, uh, what is, um, what's, a uh, how, um, how far did, how far is a uh, short range in this game? 30. Uh, five squares. Five squares. Okay, let me get my thing. One, two, three, four, five. 30 feet, if you're 30 feet, if you want to use the scale there, yeah. For okay. Lack of I, um, I, got my, I got my shock spell, which is a storm attack of the storm tradition. Um, I, can, I can have that on hold uh, if anyone, if, uh, you know, if those... Uh, if you are holding your action to attack or do something. What is your action at this point? I mean, if you're going to use it, are you going to use a different thing? Because you were on hold for this round to do that. You said earlier. Yeah. It's now your time to use it. Either use it or use something to. else. Okay. Um, did the bandits notice me or no? They have not noticed you at this time. Okay. I'm going to keep. Um, I'm going to keep my cover. Yeah. So you're not going to attack? I'm just confirming. Uh, right. Not at the moment. Okay. So we'll go into the next round. Okay. Wait. Francesca, I have to. Wait. You I got yours. My, my distract. I'm going to try to distract the one closest to me. So so I have to just roll go. in intelligence. What are you using this skill from? It's an attribute that you can use. It's an attack action that you can use. Short range. Oh, sure. Attack, okay. Distract. Target, sorry. Intelligent target makes next attack slash challenge roll that they have with two mains. Okay. You have to. Uh, okay. Where is that? Sorry. So new rules it's for my everybody. intelligence versus their intelligence. Yep. You just roll, and if you beat their intelligence. Which, just so you know, you got to beat a 10. Oh, my goodness. Mm. I rolled a 2. You like did I got not a three. I got a 3, but I rolled a 2. Like, that's... Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Metal mayhem. Mm -hmm. So... Dude, All right, you rolled a two, so you're. So what does that? That was your action. Yep. I mean, that's it. they still have to roll. They might roll a one. Yeah. Yep. Oh, sorry, you're correct. Hold on the hope. 
Hello. You had a plus zero and I had a plus one. Okay. Um, he's not distracted. What were you trying to distract him with? So I kind of, what were you doing then? Um, I was just going to, I was going to have uh, unit 58 just let out the most like monotone mm -hmm. scream. Just go, ah, and kind of like wave arm, like, their arms around. And uh, it didn't work. They just look stupid. Maybe they're <laughs> malfunctioning. You don't know. Okay. I, I found it. All right. Well, you're sitting there. Um, we've covered everybody. Yep, yep. Well, then we're going to go with, okay, let's go with this guy here. He's the closest one. Took two down. He's looking in the woods and, because he just got hit by a rock. And I he's behind the mage. <laughs> and you're up on a slight ravine because on the road. Um, he's gonna do a quick. Well, the seventeen on the stealth, so. Well, he's still looking for you. Didn't he? Did very poorly at perceiving you. But he sees, uh, friend, unit fifty-eight, and moves closer. You just hold still, and he grabs, one, attempts to grab one of your arms. Okay, grab. Yeah, Versus great, to... it's against my agility. <laughs> Okay, let's do this thing. I'm trying, I'm reading up on it. It says strength or agility attack versus target's agility. Yep. So what's your agility? Minus two. Well, what's the, the total score? Oh, I haven't rolled it yet. A nine. He, he grabs you. Great. And now if someone else grabs me, it's an automatically successful. That's what it says. You just hold still. Take you back to the rest of them. Okay, so if I'm grabbed, what does that mean for my actions? Like I can only fight it? Oh, there it is. I see it. Grab creature cannot move away. Creature size is larger, which it is. When the grab creature moves, the grabbing creature can choose to move with it or end the grab. Okay. So they can choose yeah. to move with me, but the only thing is I cannot move. So potentially I could attack. Or try to break free again. Or try to on break your, free. On your turn. Okay. <clears throat> hmm. Excuse me. All right. Um, second one moves forward. He's also going to try to grab you. Automaticals. It's an automatic success. Then he's going to start to try to tie your metal arms behind your back. That is going to be what his next action right now. He just grabbed you. Okay. One of them heads into the woods where they they see the goblin. Did you? Yeah, you failed your stealth check, correct? Yeah, yeah, I rolled a nine or an eight or something or a three. It yeah. was low, poorly. <laughs> yeah. This guy's trying to kind of standing here watching both of you. This guy comes up to you, Stephen, and he's going to attempt to hit you with a club. Just okay because and uh, nine. He misses. I yeah. I'm assuming you have at least 10. My For my defense? Yes. <clears throat> um, oh, wait. Defense, yes. My is 12. My defense is 12. He hits the tree like above you. He misjudged your height or something. <laughs> or he looked into your eyes and got creeped out. Yep. But he misses you. We're back to your turn, sir. 
Oh, I, so I'll do a so this next round we, we choose fast or slow again, right? Yep. Okay. Uh, just uh, so we get right, uh, who's gonna choose fast and slow? Since he's at the top, he's I assumed he was gonna choose fast. Fast. Well. Okay, so you're gonna choose fast this time. So you're right. Let me um, real quick. Zachary or Zachariah? Yeah, Zachariah. Um, slow or fast? Hmm. Um, I will, um, I will continue to be, I will continue slowness. <laughs> okay. I'm going to do, uh, slow this time. Okay. You still go before those. Can I do fast this time? You may do fast. Uh, where are you? Come on. Oh, you're up there. So he's going to do fast, fast, fast. And he's going to do slow in case he needs to. All right. One on, on bile Attempt, tries to hit you again. Even more humiliating as a bandit. <laughs> he should just throw his club away and become a file. Is, is a slippery <laughs> dude. All right. The, uh, but just for flavor, like he moves so fast that the cockroach like stays in midair where he was, and the guy's <laughs> club hits one of them, and he goes, No! Flam! <laughs> <laughs> and growls at the guy. All right, mini. The uh, excuse me, I'm gonna do it. Did it again. Unit fifty eight. Um. So the one gentleman you chose slow, correct, or did you choose fast? I think I said fast. All right, you did choose fast. Your turn then. So if you're going to, so to escape, I would have to escape from both of them. <laughs> It's escape, right so now, it's one of them, is, they managed to get your hand. One of them is going to be in the process of getting out his rope to tie you up. So currently, on a fast move, I would give you that to... So if I succeed... You have it's... one holding you right now, but he's got both your arms behind your back. So you'll be at minus one bane. Or an escape? Yeah, to get away. It says, uh, okay, it says strength or agility attack versus target strength if grabbed. Yep. Get three moves up to half speed. Okay. You want to do, my, it's minus one, Bane? Yep, just because it's got both your arms holding tight. If you just have one, I'd be... I guess it doesn't state one object. way or the other, so... Okay, I just go completely still in their arms. Panic what? shuts you down. I Damn. rolled three. <laughs> no. Why? I to? literally have... <laughs> I rolled it above a ten once, I think. You have rolled, rolled higher it, rolled on every d6 that you've rolled <laughs> than your d20s. That's true. Wow. You know, Absolutely wild. Suddenly stops becomes a dead weight object. For these guys. It'd be a great time to explode, but right, it would. <laughs> You're not impaired though, or under any. You just stopped because of a minus. You got panicked. They handled you wrong. <laughs> Maybe if they're too rough with my object form, I'll explode. <laughs> they just manually stopped your key. Mm -hmm. What the hell? And it's like you. He lets go, and you don't even move. You're stiff as a. An unmoving object. A dead 75 pounds. <laughs> I'm not carrying it. You hear him one yell. But be careful. Something's in the woods throwing rocks at us. This is the one you injured earlier. 
And speaking of, we're going to do it again. Yes, it is your turn. Arm. Is he armed? He's got clubs and a longbow string across his back. Could I disarm him with a sling? Like, hit his hand? You can do a cold shot. Well, the, the tag and attribute, there's disarm function. Is a strength or agility tag versus the higher the strength, strength or agility. Yep, with two banes. And he would drop it. You would hit him right in the hand, and he would drop his club. Or I could just keep attacking him until he dies. Let's do that instead. I'm going to do that instead. <laughs> until he finds me. So go Where's ahead and roll. Sheet? There it is. Slain. Hit. Flat. Not a problem. One point, though. One point. To 15. Damn. So the moment he says, someone's in the woods attacking us with rocks. Rock. <laughs> All right. And I'm going to roll two perceptions. There she is. There it is. My, she, my, she is. Making sure. Oh, both of them point oh, wow. to see you this time. Super found me. They really can't do well. This is their action now. Okay, we got uh, it is now Bio's action. All right, <clears throat> so first I'm going to uh retreat so I can move away up to half my speed and it does not trigger a free attack. Um, so that's one, two, three, four. <laughs> Five. Um, and then I'm going to uh, distract uh, that guy and say, um, uh, and say, uh, say, uh, you swinging that club would be more useful if you were trying to uh, dig trash out of a bin. Goblin makes no sense. Yeah. <laughs> so that's uh, intelligence. Yep. So an intelligence attack. There's my intelligence attack. A 20. Another 20. Oh, no, wait. Wait. Oh, I didn't do it. Oh, I didn't do it. Oh, That's a bandit. Damn. That's you. Three. Man, this is going well. You need a better insult. It's going real well. I gotta come up with better, better, better insults. All right, uh, Zachariah. <sighs> All right. So the uh, are the bandits approaching us? Um, they're not approaching you specifically. They have only, they have, well, I went yeah, ahead of their turn, but they will notice uh, the tall lady with the sling. And this one just yelled, he got hit. And this one just uh, surprised that the metal object in front of him stopped moving. You should electrocute them. Both. Okay, I'll give. Okay, I will. Um, I will go ahead and uh, cast my shock spell. They are within range, correct? Yep. Um, easily. Yep. Um, do I do this with any boons or no? Not just a straight up spell in this case. It is of your power level to use, so you don't have to roll any extra. All right. Cool. Okay. Cool. <clears throat> Ooh. Which one? You can only target an individual, so which one? Okay. I will... Um, I'll go ahead and take out take out this one. Okay. Ah, can't type today. 
any day, actually. Raise up my right hand and uh, shoot elect shoot uh, zapping electricity from my from my hand at the bandit. He just stands up. His hair goes up in the air. You, you. I mean, if you could smell from where he is, you would definitely smell the singeing of burnt hair and fabric. Nice. Big burn spot on his chest. He took quite a bit of damage. Did we lose you, Steve? Or did you just just? Oh, there we go. I mean, I just may or may not have like kids or something run through at some point in time. So if I pop my video off for a second, no problem. I just wanted to make sure I didn't lost you. Yeah, yeah. I get it. How are the youngins doing, by the way? Fantastic. Getting ready to go back to school. Fantastic, right? (laughs) (laughs) All right. So, excuse me. Um, you definitely hit hurt this one. Um, roll a one d six just to do something here, Zachary. Oh, roll one d six. All right. Cool. Hmm. I have to double check something since I didn't bring it up, but I can't remember if it was on a six or a one. Just a second. That is a one for the audience. Oh, I'm in the wrong sheet. I forgot to open up. Uh, where is it? There it is. Oh yeah, what was the um, what was the one d six roll for? It was to see if you injured him. Yeah. I was trying to remember it was on a one or a six. Oh, for creatures, okay. So, uh, I'll look at that later. But let's see if I need one it. He did not suffer damage at this time. How disappointing. I'm being attacked. (laughs) Go away, kitty. Um, yeah, I'm not going to worry about the injury because I did not find it right off the top of my head, but he's definitely hurting. There's a burn char right in the center of his chest. You took, I mean, he's staggering pretty good. You took half his hit points away from him in one attack. That's way better than the slang. And he wasn't wearing metal armor, so he didn't get a boon, so I would have missed that. Okay. Yeah, uh, all right, then um, they do notice both of you, especially with the lightning shooting out of one of your hands. They're over there. (laughs) I rolled before, and both of them got good scores. Um, Since they took slow actions, they were intending to tie up and move her, but now they're just going to take their action and attempt to attack each of you. One of them is going to char- attempt to charge at the at Nicole. The other one is going to attempt to undo his cross, not his crossbow, his longbow, and get ready to shoot. So the first Ooh. attack. Where did my sheet go? Where did my sheet go? I will get organized someday. Dang it. They roll like I do in real life. They miss <laughs> defense. Ah, four versus your defense. Your defense is likely 10 or above. They only rolled a four. Do I roll defense or? No, no. I mean, you just, your defense is considered your armor class, but it could be for more than armor. So, gotcha. It's 11. So. Yeah. He rolled a four. Most people start with a 10 or nine, depending on their ancestry. 
Second one attempts a longbow attack. That one was aimed at the lightning because the magic user should be shot first. Understandable. And uh, does it beat your defense of 15? Uh, he rolled a 15. Does it beat your defense, Zachariah? Oh, let me take a look. It should. I believe you probably have a 10 or 11. Yeah, okay, yeah, the defense is 10. All right, you take three points of damage. Now, on the character sheets for this game, you add it to the center circle. You uh -huh. don't subtract it from your health. You just add, put it in the middle. So mm -hmm. you have three points, and you will add it up until and let me know when it reaches your hit points or halfway through. Okay, um, so I... So I um, so I take uh, three points off my health? Nope, you just add three points into the center circle. Yep, I did. Don't worry. Don't think of that. The health is something different. That affects other roles and stuff, so you don't want to change that. But Okay, sounds good. So as an object, am I, since it's not incapacitated, am I like just a, stuck in a useless body aware of what's happening around me? Not even aware of what's happening, I believe. Not even aware. Okay. Not even aware. Uh, need to get to you. <clears throat> All right. Uh, so now it is the next round. Who is going to take the fast action? We know Slow. that Unit 58 is taking no actions at this time. So. <clears throat> you are going this slow, Nicole? Yep. Because I got to move. Zachary? Oh, um, it's okay for, It's okay to move? You would have to do a slow action. This is that just telling me if you're going to do slow or fast this round. <clears throat> okay, okay. So, um, okay. So, um, do I make an, uh, so, so I make an, uh, so I so I click on agility to um... nope you don't do anything you're just letting me know for initiative order right now are you going to make a slow action this round where you take a move in an action or are you going to take a fast action where you try to do something like a attack just move oh. what do you okay uh, well since this guy is like right in uh since got since this guy is right in my facility um uh, I'll be able to, I will um will I most like Am I more likely to be able to defend myself if I do it if I do a fast? Fast is either you could run away. You're not directly our fast is you could do another action, get something out. <clears throat> oh yeah. I mean I got a okay. Um you know, I got a dagger. I could get him with that. Or you have to move again. and attack, but yeah. So you'd have to do a slow, so you'd have to move, so we can do that. Okay. So I'll just uh, so I'll move slightly over here. Or not, not your turn yet. Not your turn yet. Move your. Okay. Oh, sorry. Okay. I missed did that before. I had the wrong. He should have been there attacking her. Gotcha. The other guy shot you. So yep, that's on me. But he's right there in front of you too. Okay, so you're gonna go. You're gonna go fast then to attack him if he's right there. Um. Yep. Okay, I'll move you to the top of the list. Anybody else doing fast? Did we lose you, Steve? Can't hear you, Steve. You mute. I'm gonna go fast. Okay. Everybody else going slow. Okay, this Everyone guy is me. going to fast. This guy is going to go slow. I'm trying to find the right. Oh, yeah, I forgot about somebody. This guy. That little guy. All right. They're all going to go slow, so the rest of you can all. So the two fast, we're going to start out with the Zachari. Now you can make your fast attack with your dagger if you wish to. Okay. Um, do I? Hmm. I have it in my, I have it as equipment. Um, so do I? Um, Should so be I, on your I, front panel.
Oh, I guess I didn't put it in there. I didn't get put in there. It's a one. Just uh, roll a d20. Okay. No problem. It's plus zero for you. Unless you can use your um, your strength or agility, it doesn't matter for you. Okay. Um, okay. Uh, the dagger's on, so I'll click it. Okay, oh, you go. hit it for one point of damage. You just hit him with electricity, and now you hit him with a dagger. Shank. He's not liking you. Hmm. For some reason, I'm um, trying to click on the dice, and the uh, and the menu is not coming up. Maybe, uh, maybe I need to refresh it. Are you in dark mode? I see. <laughs> Mine's all black. I notice that. <clears throat> no, I mean, you know, it was working the last couple of times. I was, I was, I was uh, clicking the dice, but right, but you know, right now, uh, right now, it's uh, doesn't seem to be working. So I'll, right. I'll I guess I'll just refresh the page. All right. Otherwise, yeah, you already. Had Attack, so you did fine, you said. Oh, no, you didn't. Not this time. Oh, there it is. All right, so you're done. Um, we're going to move on to Bile. All right, Bile is going to... Um, so the guy had a, a club, right? All right, so I'm going to um, do a called shot. Um at his face to try and get him in the eyes. Which one are you attacking? I'm a, this the one that here? was chasing after me with that club. Okay. So it's a uh, an attack with two banes. So I'm loading up the sling and <laughs> flicking a stone at his eyes. There. There we go. Here. And we're going to do minus two. Five. Ah, ah, damn. A branch. <laughs> the wind moves a branch and it deflects your stone. Alrighty. That's All me. right. I had him as fast. I had the wrong one. Which one? I'm going to switch them up. The one that's standing in front of the Zachary attempts to... I'm going to call him Zachariah. Zachariah. He attempts to attack you again. And I keep losing my bandit sheet. Dang, damn it. He just misses you. You are a master dodging machine. All right, Nicole. That would have hurt, too. So we're going to move over to Unit 58. Are you going to disengage? Yes. Okay, so that'll take... Uh, let's see. What is the disengage rule here? It's retreat. Retreat. That's what it's so called. So you can you can move, but it, they get a free attack on you, or you can take the retreat action, which is half of your movement. Uh, and what the hell is that? Movement. It is. It's on the quick reference. Under um, actions core, like the very first one. Here's ten. One, first two, column. Two. Uh, I should be able to take it if I'm cut in half. 
if my speed is cut in half. Yep. Not if she's cut in half. That won't work out. But yeah, repair skill. You might have it, Jerry Ray. <laughs> Okay, so yeah, you're going to attempt to get to her and uh, turn the key? Yes. Yeah. One, two, three. Diagonal? Does that work? What is your movement? Well, that was okay. three squares. Uh, speed 10. How much can I move total? Five squares total. So yeah, five squares total. Oh, so it'd be like. Oh, you squares. can move ten total if you if you're taking the attack, but you can move five without taking a a, a free attack. Okay, so go cool. right. Here. Yeah, That's good. You only moved a one, two, three, four. Yep, five would put you right on top of her. Do I have to be right on top, or can I be right next to? Him? Yep, I would say you were close enough. Just have to be next to him. You know. All right. Cool. Go over there, turn. Okay, and you got a guy right across from you. All right, you are activated. I mean, unit okay. 58. I thought they were holding me from like they were holding my hands behind my back. No, uh, they were holding me, but you. when you went in uh, when you went in operable or object mode, okay. they left you there because you weren't moving. Perfect. And also oh, one guy the, the one guy electrocuted. This one guy is standing here on just on the other side of you. <laughs> Okay. You look up and you see Nicole standing in front of you, and the guy was behind you, but you may not see him because you're standing up. My All apologies. Right. Your puppy playing with his toy. Okay. Do I, I have to wait for a turn now, though, right? Um, you are at the bottom of the order since you just okay. came to. All right, so that is this guy's action. He sees you right there. He had just shot an arrow at you before. He's reloaded. And you're within close range now. I've damaged you if it beats your defense. Is the me, right? Yep. Cool. Ow. That's like half of her health. So she got skewered. All right. This gentleman. Oh, here. I'm going to go back up here. One, two, three, oh, Was there a charge? Charge. Yes. And he's going to attempt to smack you, Stephen. Or excuse me, Bile. And he fails miserably. Was that a charge? Yeah, he is, he he missed it. He could have knocked you out down or something. Yeah. Okay. So then he has a one bane penalty until the yep. end of the round. Yep. Sweet. Basically, he was trying to knock you down from quit running. <clears throat> Never. And then we're going to go next one. This guy is seeing a lot of things. And let's, he's going to attempt to target you since he sees the other guy jumping around. But he's going to take a minus Bane since his friend is right there in front of him. I'm assuming he doesn't beat your defense. Seven. Against who? You. Oh, absolutely not. He tried using a longbow attack against you, but okay. It, yeah, does does not hit. 
And we're back at the top of the round. Who's going fast? Who's going slow? Fast. Fast. <clears throat> slow. Wait, does um is a free is taking out a weapon a free action? Yeah. Okay. Fast. All of you are taking fast then? Just to confirm? Or did uh, I miss the slow? Slow. Okay. Zachariah. Oh yeah. Um I'll just, yeah, I'll go I'll be um Yeah, I'll take it fast since I'm probably since I'm probably fighting this bandit. All right, then we're going to start out with uh, Unit 58. Okay. Um, after uh, screaming my apologies to Nicole, um, they're going to pull out their club and just try to come down as hard as they can on this person in front of them. Let's hope it's a good roll. <laughs> Any seventeen? There oh, you go. Right. Grab yeah. the wrong thing. It was. Yeah, uh, that's fine. I'll let you have this. Step. I'll let you have the attack roll. Just roll your club for damage. I think it's a, It's a, It's the same five damage. Yeah, it's the same modifier. Yep, it's, it's strength. Yep, he's definitely oh, hurting. I did something. Nicole, you're up. Uh, we're going to follow up with uh, taking out a knife and hopping over there. You move yourself oh. and then... Oh, no, you're on a fast. You can't move. All right. I'm on a fast. I can't move. I mean, I guess we're you, swinging in. You could only move. <laughs> no, we're gonna, we need kings to die. So we'll sling. Or throw a knife if you have a knife. Yeah. Sling. Oh, yeah. Okay. Daggers can be um, thrown, right? Yes. Short range. Sure. Fantastic. Yeah. We'll do that. If that's what you had in your hand, I'm just saying. I can switch to that. I mean, they both do the same damage. Yep. We'll just do a sling. Boop. No. No, we won't. I have an have a, a arrow in me and it hurts. All right, Zachary or Zachariah. I'm going to screw that up all night. <laughs> what are you doing, sir? You got the guy in front of you? You're going to stab him again? You lose you, sir? Are you muted? He's muted. Oh, sorry. 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 I'm going to stab yeah. him again. All right. No problem. Nice. He's definitely hurting. You hear wheezing coming out of it. You stab, hit him with electricity before, and now you stabbed him a few times. He is not doing good. Oh, hey, um, I'm gonna need some assistance. How do I change this image? Um, because you know, I'm got, I got, um, I got this Merlin pick in the center. I'm trying to change it. Uh, at this time, I'm not sure at the moment. Just give okay. me a second. I, not a problem. I don't want to. I'm not gonna pause the game over it. Yep. Um, yeah, there's no change on your side. All right. So this is the one in front of you. Also, is gonna go fast, Zachary. And that one mm -hmm. is gonna try to hit you with the club again. He missed. Uh, the one you just hit, Unit 58, is going to try to, is going to drop his longbow and grab his club. Okay. Does a 15 hit you? It does. He does three damage to you. Okay. I'm a it's a third of, a third of my damage, but it's okay. Um... The one on Bile attempts to hit him again with the club. And 
And he hits you for this time. He does hit you for three points of damage. All right. It hurts. There's a loud, like, very strange squeal out in the woods. Mm -hmm. And it is now your turn, Bile. All righty. Um, having taken that first hit and starting to and looking around and, and not really knowing which way this is going to go, um, he's going to... Let me do this to you. He's going to set off in a dead sprint, clear across the road. Two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And he's going to take that free attack. Five more points of damage Ouch. as you try running away. Uh, and that is, uh, uh, and he's going to. Uh, slump into the uh, road uh, uh, incapacitated. Ooh. All right. And that would be that one. Yep. You are incapacitated at zero, correct? At zero. I'll have to look up how to read the fate. I can't remember all it off completely off the top of my head. So I all fall right. prone. Yep. And I remain incapacitated. Yep. As long as you don't take any more damage, you should be... I'm going to do a quick perception check with that guy to see if he sees anybody else. He's going to target the metal man, metal person, excuse me, with his longbow. Does an 11 beat your defense, Unit 58? An 11 does not, actually. An arrow hits Unit 58 right square and just bounces off. Clink, clink, clink. <laughs> yeah. Awesome. All right. It is Unit 58's turn. Oh, is it back up at the top? I'm gonna just uh yeah. It, yes, it is back at the top. Exactly Excuse me. Round? Okay. So yeah. at the end of the round, um I roll a fate roll. Um or I guess hold on. I'm incapacitated. Uh become yeah, so I, I roll a fate roll. So I roll a one D six. On a one I start dying. On a six I heal one damage. I yep. become impaired for one minute. Uh, any other roll has no effect. Six, dun, six, dun, dun. Six. Four. Okay, you're yeah. laying there, not bleeding out at least. All right, that was the end of the round. So you cannot take any action this time, so you'll be at the bottom. Uh, unit 58, what are you, long, short, quick, fast, since you're right I'm in combat? I'm going to do fast, and I'm going to try to attack again. All right, Nicole, what are you going to do? Uh, slow. All right. And what are you going to do, Zachariah? I was going to slow. You said slow? Oh, yeah, um, I'll go um, I'll, I'll go slow. Okay, I have to figure out that one's that one, that one, that one. Okay, he's going to go fast. That one's going to go fast. That one's going to go slow. Oh, he's still above the dying goblin. He is going to 
real fast. Yep, all right. Unit 58, you would go first. Okay, um, I'm going to attack again. You just nice. You're you're whittling don't, these don't. guys down. <laughs> <laughs> I need to summon Mini. <laughs> oh God, yeah. <laughs> All right, uh, so that would leave Bandit on Zachariah. Or did you want to go fast before I couldn't? Oh yeah, I'll um, I'll stab the guy again with my dagger. Okay, you were going fast. That's right. All right. Go ahead. You. He's barely hanging on. You can't believe he's taking all this damage and still there. He's at and I'm like, point. I'm like, I can't believe I was scared of you. All right, so he's going to attempt to stab you. But I'm just being generous here, so. Does it beat your, is your armor class defense 10 or better? Oh, yeah. My, um, my de uh, let me take a look. My Yeah, my defense is a 10. You take six points of damage. Okay. One, and I don't know what you took earlier, but if you hit ten, you're down or whatever your AC is. Um yeah, I took three before, so that plus six is nine. Alright, so you're both at one hit point. <laughs> All right, unit 58. Yay! He okay. fails to hit you. Oh, and I'm like, oh, he's, he's and another arrow bounces off of you also. And we are at Nicole. I forgot what can I do. I had a slow action, right? You are at slow action, so you can move and attack this time. Cool. I don't think I need to move right now, but I can attack. I want to do the one that has like the lowest, the one who looks like it's about to topple over. Absolutely. That would be this one. Yeah. Just knock. They're both pretty much there. You just have to hit them. Can I do two attacks? There is an option for that, but you take a bane on each one. That's fine. Uh, I, let's see. It's under the cheat section. Or... Take a bane? Mm -hmm. uh, just a second. Because hit multiple targets. Quick reference. Found there somewhere. I couldn't find it on the Two reference. weapon attacks. One target with each main weapon. Two targets attack with main weapon hand versus one target and attack offhand versus another target. Each attack with three banes. Oh, that's if you're having two weapons. Two different targets. Yeah, if you had two weapons, if you wanted to do that, oh, you could no, target two. Pain, pain yeah. with one. Yep, you only get one attack otherwise. Yeah, okay. So okay. You, just to give you an idea, one of them is at two hit points, one of them is at one hit point. And unless his defense is a below a six, I did not hit him. Yeah. Which one were you? Okay, you they uh, missed, one in front of Zachariah. Which, yep, you missed him. And you did. One, two, three. No, go away. Was, was that the end of the round? 
And not quite. Okay. I got you at the last person at the end of the round. And he's going to. He's going to. Hit Ow. you for three points of damage. Uh, yeah, that's successful. Uh huh. Not down yet, but ow. Okay, and now it is your turn to roll bile. All right. All right. Um, we're back at the top of the order. Are we going to stay in the same positions? Fast, fast. Are you going to move up the fast, Nicole? We're fast, are yeah. You, are you going to run? <clears throat> I'm going to stay way. fast. All right. Then I'm going to go in the order of Unit 58. Okay. Um, I'm going to try to hit the guy I've been hitting. Hopefully take him out. Okay. Twelve. Let's see. Strength twelve. Health. Blah, blah, blah. Nope. Not quite. Oh. <laughs> hmm. These guys, when they switch to their clubs. Oh no! Actually, let's bring that down. I have to check something. I can't That's remember what great. a shield brings because he was. Oh no, he wasn't the one using enough bow. He was using his club. So yeah, he would have had his small shield up. Oh, so they also yeah. had shield. Yeah, they all had. Uh, they're all wearing bigger dean armor. They all have a small shield. They all are carrying a club and a bow. Mm -hmm. So. Should have just kept running. <laughs> <laughs> um. So let's see. We're at top. Uh, you, okay, uh, Zachariah, your turn. Okay. Just, just um, have to hit him. Huh? You just have to hit him. I know. All right. One more dagger strike. Stop, stop, stop. Oh, come on. Don't all die in the first combat. <laughs> hey, I, never, I never intended to. Uh, all right. Um, Nicole. Um, just got to hit him. Which one are you targeting? The same one I was targeting before. Yes, I have this okay. new one in front of me, but he needs to go. I'm fine with that. I just we want to make sure. Him. All right. Awesome. I'm saved. <sighs> oh, why can't I put symbols on these anymore? Did they hide them? <laughs> That was a 16. They used to have symbols you could put on these objects. I guess not going anymore for the free account. There should be. Like an X? Yeah, that's how I'm trying to find it. Yeah, I can draw it. There we go. Thank you, whoever. That was me. All right, one down. Yay. And that was the one that was next to attack, so he is off the list. All right, the one on... Where is the sheet? Club, oh, yeah. It's going to attempt to hit unit 58 again. And misses. Yay. The one with the bow attempts to hit her also. Excuse me. Yeah. And 
as he pulls the string back, something happens. No, that is no negative. He fails miserably, almost hitting his own guy. And that's then the one in front of you, Nicole. Two damage. I believe she's out. So you are also incapacitated. So you fall collapsing to the Fuck. ground. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You can't turn my key. I think there's an out there's a way to like help though. Yeah. Yeah. One. All right, uh, Bile, I need you to roll your dice again. Oh, and uh uh, Nicole gets me? to join me yep, this time. And, yep, she gets to join you. Oh, so close. So I'm unconscious now. Oh yeah, Four. you did it three times. You roll a 1d3. All right, first I'm time around. For three hours. <laughs> Okay. Vinny. Excuse me, I did it again. Unit 58. Okay, so <laughs> stabilize is an action. Okay. Mm. Running is an option, you guys know that, right? Yeah, if it's just me and Zach Gariah, right? It's abandoned our unconscious bodies, it's fine. <laughs> It's me and Zachariah that are still up. Currently. Okay. And to stabilize, it says it's an intelligence challenge with one bane. What is it that you need to succeed? You have to beat a 10. Beat a 10? But this guy diagonal to me is almost dead, too. This guy gentleman in front of you is almost dead. This one is at full health, and this one is at full health. And, and stabilize is if they are dying. Yeah, so, if they consider like, dying until they're not, not until they're... No, they're, they're, out, considered, right? they're considered disabled. Okay, and so then I'm going dying to attack if roll, that guy. If we roll a one. Currently, Bile is unconscious, but stay stabilized. And you really can't tell because his eyes don't close. So he's just <laughs> kind of staring at you all, motionless. Okay. I'm going to try to hit this guy. Then. Oh, nah, there's the ones again. Mm -hmm. I don't know how to save you guys. <laughs> run, run. <laughs> run. No saving. run. <laughs> Is what level zero is. <laughs> Literally level, level zero. zero. Level zero. You know, the quick bloody story that needed to be told. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, Zachariah, you're up. <clears throat> you do not have anybody on top of you right now or attacking you. Yeah. Um, okay. So... Okay, I'll, uh, you know, I can make a run for it, uh, you know, go 30 feet up here. That is what you're going to do for your action this round? Uh, yep. Did it go the fast? Mm hmm You have a six yeah. for your speed? Do I have a six for my speed? Yeah. What's your speed? Because you can move, you can move that number of squares. Okay, uh, let me check. Oh, speed! My speed's a ten. Oh yeah, so you can move ten squares if you want to. All right. Um, oh wait, let me check that. One. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right. All right. Let's put the icons on. That's why I can't do some stuff. Oh, so there's no way to help someone who is just down and disabled unless you're... Uh, if you get an opportunity to, yeah. I mean, you could try. I mean, slap them awake or something, but, you know, there's... Would you have something? Everybody should have a portion of healing, or some some of you do. Yeah. I, uh, I, maybe I do, yeah. There's things like this. I mean... Basically, right now is trying to survive or get away. Depending on how bio fell, there may be <laughs> a healing potion laying next to him. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I'm just throwing that out there. All hope is not lost. You just have to survive or get away. It's hard to get away when you have two people on the ground. Let's see. We leave them. We could leave them. I mean, that's what Zechariah is doing. Yeah, I do have a healing. That we know of. Maybe he's reading a scroll to himself to transport himself to somewhere. My spell is so that's not running away. either. <laughs> uh, a healing potion. And that would, to shove a healing potion in someone's mouth would be an action, right? Yes. Drinking one yourself would be an action. Okay. I know, Kitty. I can't do anything about it. Put your me out. And the <laughs> healing potion I does how too. much healing? What was that? A healing potion does it's how however much, healing? much that person heals. It's, oh, like yeah. person it's based, heals. On based on oh, your healing rate. It's based on your healing rate. Great. Mine's like two. That would be so bad. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Would you shut up, dude? Yeah, I have a cat too. Well, this is his normal playtime. We play with Red Dot about now, and he's being a little butthead right below my feet, meowing at me. Mm -hmm. I can hear him. Hope it doesn't trigger my cat to come. And as a main coon mix, he's pretty damn loud when he wants to be. Oh, I have a black cat, so he's just obnoxious. Me too. All right. I'm um, sorry. I got distracted. That guy's dead. This guy will attempt to attack. Oh, is that to me? Yes. Okay. It's fine. I'm, I'm, That's I'm, I'm just fine. <laughs> Mere flesh wound. If you had flesh. <laughs> I'm beating pretty bad, but it's fine. <laughs> the metal is like starting to get dented in at multiple places. Hey, if you explode, you can take them all out. I know, but then I'd also take out Nicole. I'll get Nicole up, and then I'll explode. <laughs> <laughs> okay, just a second. I think he's within short range yet. Ooh, just over. Oh, when you prepare a trigger action, you get one boon when triggered. No, good enough. Okay. Zachariah, you take three points. I would assume a 15 hits you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So how much? Three points. So you're probably at zero now or below. Yeah, so um, total of 12 damage. Well, you would just be consider yourself at zero for now, and you're incapacitated. You will make rolls at the end of the round like three others. 
Oh, two others. <laughs> this is just going to be like another memory Unit 58 has from exploding. No, yes. not all hope is lost. I mean, <laughs> right now none of you have died. And you're worth money to the bandits. True. Yeah, you're still yeah. up, so he's going to try to hit you from behind. And it misses. Uh, I lived for another round. <laughs> the one who rolled the most ones lived the longest. I know, right? <laughs> Oh my goodness. Well, I didn't have as much time getting beat up like you guys did. It was an object. All right. Um, three of you need to make some, or two of you need to make some dice rolls. Three. I don't think. Uh, oh, sorry. Vile doesn't need to. He Vile's just three. taking a nap. His little cockroach friends are kind of like licking at nibbling his bloody at the wounds. blood. <laughs> Nibbling at the blood that's pooling around him. It's probably what Bio would have wanted. And that's your second <laughs> one? To... Yep, that's number two. All right, and uh, Zachariah, you need to roll a 1d6. Six, 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 six. I feel it. I believe. Ah, <laughs> two. <laughs> okay, that's your first time round. Okay. All right, I'm assuming you're going to go first. Unit I'm going to do fast, and I'm going to... I'm gonna shove a, my healing potion into Nicole's mouth. Was that a okay? So was that a safe throw? That was to see if you were gonna die or start dying, or if you were gonna stabilize. You right now you're in limbo. You have to succeed twice or roll a six. Don't roll a one. <laughs> so okay, All right. so, so I so I failed at the two. Uh, you nothing happened to you on yeah. a two. So you're still so incapacitated. You're so just you're still considered incapacitated. There. Okay. And let's see. What do so, I roll for peeling potion down mouth and regenerating health? Uh, it's the healing rate, and it's the number above your health in that circle. Healing rate at the two, probably. Yep. Just going to go two down. <laughs> yep. And you can either pour it on or force them to consume, depending on. Does it the same thing? I for say right now. I'm going to let it go. I haven't. I'm not going to look it up. Okay. It heals you either way. Okay. I, I I looked up the question on would a clock work on help work on a healing potion and yeah. No, I I did it to Nicole. <laughs> yeah, I know, but I was looking up that. Potions don't work for clockwork. They have to get repaired. Uh, it will when you're in. Uh, act when you're not in object mode. In object mode, oh, you okay, have to be okay. repair because it's considered a magical substance and it never. Yeah. Okay. There was a big, long thing written up about it I read because that was one of the questions I had. Nicole's awake. And that was your only action? Yeah. I think that's all Wait, I can do. I can do? Yep. Otherwise, yeah, I take a bane on a second thing. Yeah. I think that's all I can do. As your back is turned to this guy, he's going to attempt to grab you again. Oh, okay. <laughs> Fight me. <laughs> I'm going to fail. Oh, no. Just let me explode. <laughs> no! Damn. I don't Jeez. think I can beat that. 21. I can't beat that, even if I roll. You hold still. Okay. There are okay. contingency plans if you got caught. I just wasn't expecting it so easily. Which one grabbed me? The weak one or the... the this is the one who grabbed you. The one that's okay. nearly dead. God. So annoying. <laughs> it's like one, two hit points. Okay, the next one goes running <clears throat> for Zachariah. Oh, I ran on top of him. Don't want to do that. And he's going to tie him up and uh, 
make sure he's detained and not much more he can do at the moment, but he was running away and he was casting spells. Definitely worth some money. He's a magic man. He's <laughs> worth a lot. I think anybody is worth money. I should have rolled. I should have rolled for stealth. Um, this one is holding you, so you're, he's on you. And uh, are you trying to pretend to be? Oh yeah, he sh he saw her pour the potion on you, so he can't hide that. Yeah. So he's gonna attempt to grab you also. Okay. Nicole. No. He only had a nine. You could do it. <laughs> agility or strength? Really? Oh, really again? It says I believe it, it says it's agility or strength for the person doing it. It's only agility for the person being grabbed. Oh, yeah, sorry. I thought it was one or the other. Okay, yeah, so I know. My strength is better, so I had... <laughs> <laughs> I think it's just a, against your agility score. Yep, it's against your agility. Bop. Rolled against attacker's agility. Get off me. Nice I'll job. let it be an opposed roll at the moment. We can. Uh, is there a All right. You managed one? to not get grabbed by him. What are you? Okay. So you're back on the initiative order. Yes. That would have been him. All right, Bile, you are okay. Nicole, you are no longer unconscious. Zachariah, I need you to make a save. Excuse me, a 1d6 roll. See if you... Tree. Okay, you're yes. not dead. You're not dead? Not, he, not conscious either. If you can roll a 6, you get one. Basically, you're conscious. All right, so we are on Unit 58. You are being held. Should being I just hit myself? Uh, A strength or agility yes. attack roll against the strength of the creature that has grabbed you. I mean, you could hit him because he's almost dead. And then hold it goes. I could. How many? What would my bane be? Just punch him. Punch him. I'll give you one d three. Same as your. With my punch. Plus your, oh, can not, I punch him? I can't hit him with. I guess it depends on how he's holding. Well, him. you had your dagger. You poured, and you had your. I guess yeah, you could. True. Well, I had. Only, I didn't. I only had one hand open. Wait, I only have a club. Yeah. Okay. I don't know how you pour. You said you grabbed the potion and gave it to Nicole, and then you, I, previously you had been attacking okay. with a club. Then I'll punch with my hand, I guess. If that's... I don't know. Do you have your club in your hand and use the, your off hand to pour the potion? You tell yeah, me. Yeah, that's what I was envisioning, but if you don't okay. want to say that. Listen, no, no, I was fine with that. That's what I was envisioning, too. Oh, okay, okay. Then I'm going to try to hit with my club. Um, you said it's just going to be straight? Well, it would just be hit with your club, normal attack. Yeah. Watch him be two damage, two hit points, not one. He had two hit points, <laughs> not one. <laughs> it's so... I you call that one. I hope he but you do good. stagger him a little bit, because he's already weak. Roll a strength saving throw. <laughs> okay. But he still has you grabbed. Yeah. It's fair. So. Um, he can't attack and keep you grabbed. At least not as I'm seeing right now. And I'm not going to go looking up rules. One thing about not playing enough. I don't have them memorized. We'll read some more and know what to read next time. Um. All right, you're still captured. Um, Nicole, were you going to go slower or fast before? I uh, you. Slow. We got to move. Uh, 
Well, you can move when you're on a fast. We're going to move an attack. But if you want to move an attack, you have to do a slow. I'm just kidding. Yes, we're going to slow. Okay. <laughs> and just hope he misses me when he inevitably swings. All right, so he's going to attempt to grab you again because I mean, you didn't attack him last time, or did you? You just tried to avoid him. He's going to try to grab you again. Me? Yep. Okay. That is a fifteen. That he. Their objective is to capture, especially. Uh, well, he got me. That time he's got hold of you. So on your turn, you can do an escape and then a run or whatever you want to do or attack, escape. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's Bandit. Bandit. He's tying up a body. He's the one attacking you. Or on his turn. All right, we're back at the round. So, Zachariah, roll a 1d6. Uh, Tim, I think um, yeah. I think I think there's a ringing on your end. I'm not hearing anything on my end. Let's second. It's here. Oh, Take your headphones off. Alexa, <laughs> turn off the alarm. <laughs> yes, uh, it was. Your noise canceling headphones and clean out your environment. <laughs> wow. I apologize. I didn't. Wow. <laughs> it is. Well, it's gone now. Yep, it was Alexa putting on my wife's ten o'clock take pills, but she's not here. So for a while, I thought it was an ominous sound from the soundtrack. Yeah. <laughs> Alexa, turn off ten thirty alarm. Also. When it's ten thirty p.m., alarm is canceled. See, you she's. Have I have a, you know, <laughs> I have a, I, I have um, I have Alexa setting up alarm with uh, with alarms too, so I get it. Yeah, yeah shut up, talking. Alexa. Just talking and talking. <laughs> yep, and I'm not talking. He says, "Turn it off." Alexa, just shut up. Damn, only only person I can say that to. <laughs> And she's not real, so. All right. Uh, you're still unconscious. Nicole, we would be up to you then. They're on me? I think so. We went around once. Yep. All right. Because cool. you went it's slow. Cool. And then we got to do Zach's roll after that. That would be a third one. Quick reference. Strong third agility attack versus target strength. Uh, we want to do agility. The 10 versus his strength. It was a 14. <laughs> that was your action? Or... I mean, that was part one of slow. Can we double it? I don't think we can. Because the plan was to, you know, Escape and then move, but didn't escape. So I can't see. I'm trying to read what you can do when you get grabbed. Right. So it just have to be like slow and like use your movement to get up. You can't move if you're grabbed. Okay, I can't move away. I can still attack him though. So you escaped and you could attempt to attack, I guess. Yes, but I guess, yeah, might as well shank him and then get shanked back. It's fine. So, yeah, now we're going to have a dagger out. And Bob, nope, pesky nope. mine. If she gets a knife out, she tries to stab him, but still pain. Yep, he twists you out of the way so you can't accurately get a good grip on it. And we keep moving. 
All right, we're back at the top. Oh, we got a Zach. You make your fate roll. 1d6. You there, Zachary? Oh, uh, right. Um, my bad. I was I was lost in thought. Um, what would you like me to do? One d six, please. Okay, no problem. Okay, I rolled a two. All right, that was your third and final roll. You should be considered unconscious now. Awesome. You don't have to roll anymore. Where's your roll at? Oh, there it is. Let's show from my side. Then you can roll All a right. D3, and that'll tell you how many hours you're unconscious for. One D3. Long enough to be tied up. <laughs> okay, so... um. So uh, I'm still uh, I'm still um, I'm still damaged or yes you are still three. considered damaged at this time but you're not dying or risk of dying unless somebody stabs you or attempt you know okay cool cool Which they won't because you're worth money <laughs> yeah so you're considered right. uh, unconscious roll one d three see how long right. you are. Nicole and Unit Fifty Eight are the two conscious people currently. What are yes. you? Are you going to go fast or slow? Um, I'm going to go fast and just try to hit this guy again. All right, Nicole. I'm going to go fast. Just, let's just attack this guy. It's fine. <laughs> All right. Okay. Um. Somebody said. Um. So Nicole says you want me to roll a D four. No, one yeah, D3. just one d three r slash r one d three. Okay. R here. Hey, buddy. <laughs> We're taking a long nap. Finzies, long nap. Yeah, he did the same. He won. He was. <laughs> <laughs> the dice, no. <laughs> Oh. All right, unit 58, what are you going to do here? I'm going to hit this guy with my club, hopefully. Hopefully. Yeah. Hey. Oh, there you go. six hey. damage. There you go. For one hit point guy. So just, just split his skull. Dead. <laughs> there, dead. Splattered <laughs> his brains. Unit 58 just releases an You are no longer held on to. Cry. Awesome. All right. That's my turn. Nicole. Hmm. Looking at the uh, other attack things that can be done. Mm -hmm. like, how can I keep you from killing me? You can Knock defend. Down. Oh. Okay. I mean, could defend. Is that a thing? Yes, it is. Yeah. All attack yeah. can do stuff for one bane. All challenge rolls doesn't attack me with one boon. Yeah, this is a defend. Which one is it? It's defend. a defend. It's over it's in, in the action. First column. Yeah. Oh, you guys are looking at that. I'm looking in the book. That doesn't help. All attacks yeah. against you suffer one bane, and all challenge rolls resist attacks made with one boon. Wait, yes. Ah, uh, page 48. Why? That's why. Okay. Tells me what book it's in. Scroll up a little bit. Okay. All right. All right. That makes perfect sense. You're going to try to defend as best you can. Yep. All right. So that is all you're going to do. All she can do. Yep, I'm just making sure. 
dead, dead. Finishing tying up. So that guy. And he's going to attempt to hit you then, Nicole. Nicole. So. Nice. He's trying to knock you unconscious more than anything. Oh, sorry. Oh, minus one. I forgot to roll a Just a second. <laughs> I mean, I don't think that'll I do mean, anything. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> it, you can re-roll it if you want. <laughs> minus four, so it's 16. It still hits, I'm pretty sure. So 16, right. yeah, it still hits. Back to unconscious? or Yep. Incapacitated? Oh, Incapacitated. <laughs> I told you to run. I'm right. <laughs> you grabbed me. I'm the only one alive again. Well, awake again. Okay. Still. <laughs> With my two hit points. And this guy is full health. Yep. Oh, God. You'll also be like, I gave up. Don't knock me out. And then scheme. Hmm. Socials. Can All right. I don't know if he's a good liar. Um, so if you're unconscious, you need to roll your 1d6, Nicole. <laughs> yeah, da, 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 da. Roll a six. Roll a six. Oh. Uh, it's half a six. Or Halfway feet. there. I'm just going to hit him. <laughs> <laughs> It is your turn. If you're going to go fast, you can hit him. I'm going to go fast and just hit him. I need you to roll six. Uh, roll I, six. Yeah, I need that six that I had before. Three. Or that, that was two. Half of it. Yeah. Club, 18, three. All right. You hit him from behind. Wait, wait, wait. He would, yeah, but okay, never mind. Never mind. Wait, so he's at three now? No, you did okay, three damage to him. That's what I thought. He doesn't have a lot of damage on him at all. Well, he now does. He's at nine. Is what he's... Well, excuse me. He's that's up so to three. His total is 12. You do the math. Oh, nine is like the max that I had to start. <laughs> yeah, some of you had a little more than that. Okay. That's the end of my turn. Is it all their turns to attack and grab us and stuff now? Well, one of them is occupied tying up an unconscious person and checking his body over for any goods. Because they are bandits. and He knows. He thought three of his friends are over there, but, you know. <laughs> Rich-looking magic <laughs> casting guy should have money on him, right? And you consider it's only been like 12 seconds to maybe 20 seconds since he knocked him out. There's just a little a little robot. <laughs> dee 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 dee. Just bonking people. <laughs> <laughs> Even though he's he doesn't have to hold on to Nicole anymore. She's now unconscious. Okay. So, so he's, he's going to reach attack. around and try to smack you. Okay. Okay, he hits me, but I have one hit point left. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Nicole, roll your 1d6. I just want to see if she can make it. <laughs> no, the worst option, actually. Oh, no, you one. died. You're dying. Or are you dead? Dying. That means I can use dying. my health action. <laughs> then I can stabilize. Yeah, stabilize. <laughs> I won't do it yet, though. Is there, like, a time limit on stabilizing? Let's find out. I don't think so. All right. Uh, it would be your turn, Minnie. Excuse me, I did it, just it again. just can't be dead. <laughs> All the damage dealing is messing you up. Okay. I'm going to try to hit this guy. And it better work. I... Six points uh... of damage at 16. Oh my gosh. You stagger him good. I'm summoning Minnie. 
It's got to do it. Unit is going crazy. This is too much death. They've seen too much. Especially its own. That those insanity points. They're coming out now. Mm-hmm. Oh. No, I'm I'm out. All right, I want you to roll My D6. a one d six. Explode. Okay. Oh. Oh. Disappointed. All of you have been incapacitated, though not dead. Well, Nicole. At the end of each round, you're dying. Roll a d6. On a one, you die. On a six, you become disabled. Any other roll uh, number has no effect. Well, you're all unconscious and don't know what's going on. Yeah, right. so Should I roll. Skip ahead to my next our next rolls. <laughs> 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 well, um, Nicole can make her roll to see if she okay. does fail miserably right away. Mm -hmm. And also, Pretty Minnie, fun. you will make your roll. Excuse me, <laughs> unit fifty-eight. Another one. I already made one d six. Oh, you made yours. Your three. Oh, sorry. Unfortunately. Oh. Hey. And then there's a six. Yeah. Wait, but didn't you didn't you roll a one last time? Yeah. Yes. That was on the spiral. Oh, okay. Yeah. So you start spiral, to die. And then I started dying. And now and I am just disabled. <gasps> yep. Okay. And that means what? Stable this... characters are defenseless. And I have to re basically restart my rolls again. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but you are all unconscious. Yay. We are all unconscious right now. Yes. Okay, even all if right. I come back, someone has to turn my key. Okay. Even though, you know, we're going to end it here shortly because of tough. You guys will find yourselves awakened, held in cages in the bandit camp. Along I'm with several other people from the caravan. Well, that sucks. Well, <laughs> great job, guys. <laughs> Are my cockroaches still with me? Good. Question. Are they? Oh, they hid in your shirts and clothing. They fed yeah. off your How blood. How close am I to bile? One is like in the ear. Uh. And they threw bile and you in the same cage. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. I'm sorry. My apologies. He wakes up in a sneezing fit. Well, uh, this is where you guys are going to be taken and sold into slavery. <laughs> <laughs> and if we were to continue... Maybe my powerful creator can save me. <laughs> so that is where we're going to end tonight's session. I apologize you didn't survive to the city or village or one of the other fun places. You know, survived the beginning of their arc. <laughs> yeah. Well, I, you got. I, I have a feeling. It's a villain. It's a villain arc, really. A villain origin story. That could be. Um, but um, we're gonna call it for tonight and move on. And if a couple weeks, I'm hoping we can probably do another one shot, or I might even be ready to roll into one of uh the campaign settings, so we could either reset your characters or. Roll up some new ones. So just to let you know, since this is the one oh, shot. Good. Sounds but, good. Um, I, uh, stay on after we get out of here. And I was just going to ask some questions or I can post a couple on our meetup here later. Not meetup, wrong system, wrong board. Our Discord <laughs> later. <laughs> I just wanted to see which way me, because I got a, like two campaigns I was thinking of running possibly to see which ones you guys might be more interested in. So, but... Um, we're going to get ready to go. Let me switch to the other screen. There we go. We're no longer watching Roll20. Um, so you guys are going to be held captives, sold into slavery. Yeah. Fun times to be had by all. And um, so hopefully we will get the rules down a little smoother, but it, I don't think we did too bad of time. Hopefully everybody enjoyed themselves, at least on something interesting to do on a Friday night. Oh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> it's a fun system. Yeah. Uh, Enjoy it. 
I got to get the combat down a little smoother with the it's slow and fast. And roll 20 isn't really set up to handle that. There. <laughs> Not thing, so Because well. you have to switch each round. So I have to kind of keep track. But that's me on my end. And complaining about the game while on stream really isn't the best thing to do. So, <laughs> But uh, I thank you guys all for showing up. And let's give an intro out. We're going a little bit in reverse this time. Zachary or Mark, how... Um, Anything you need to plug, or how'd you feel about tonight? Anything? Oh, yeah, I enjoyed it. It was good. All right. Um, was kind of hoping you might have got that scroll off that you had. That would have been interesting. So, well, you know, well, you know it was. Um, I did some studying on the. Ma I, you know, since I'm a ma since I love the magic stuff, I studied uh, magic, and you, I studied the whole the magic system, and I'm like, you know. Um, and if we got very far, I would have been like, oh, uh, guys, like, uh, you know, this scroll, some, um, some douchey magic merchant gave me a cur gave me a cursed spell. Uh, you want to burn it? <laughs> yep. He had one of the better cursed ones that, you know, gives them corruption, but can really do some damage to one individual. So. Uh, but I'm glad you enjoyed it. Uh, unit 58, better known as Francesca. Yeah. By the way, she did the artwork for her own character. Excellent job. Love it. So. Oh, thank you. Um, yeah, it was a lot of fun. Um, it was kind of hilarious to roll so many ones. Oh, so poorly. <laughs> in the beginning, um, they were supposed to be kind of this clumsy guy, and I guess they just, just a little clumsy guy is what the dice also saw. So, yeah. It was kind of fun. Yeah. Quite a few ones on your part are <laughs> even below negative numbers. Yeah, negatives. You know, putting an object a few times. Another thing in this system I did not add to this campaign since we were learning, but there is what they call the demon's shadow, which adds different effects to what happens. Here, I'll post. Oh. Now, let's see. I got it on here. Uh Here's some of the game effects. I just posted something, you know, demonic cool. accursion. If you roll less than the oh. zero, demons appear. Oh, even better. <laughs> you know, units. Do more things we can't be... fight. Yeah, or, <laughs> exactly. Unit or weird magic. Like if you roll less than a zero, <laughs> strange things happen when you do some checks. Other systems, I mean, they got the Black Sun. I mean, if you look at the core book, which I think I gave you guys uh, some viewability access, they will they show that in the GM section, some of the interesting add-ons you can add to make some special effects. But all right, uh, we're going to head out of here tonight. Uh, we're going to move on to Nicole, better known as Tommy. How are you? What Did you enjoy yourself uh, this evening? Yes, I was not expecting the exploration part. And also us just literally probably avoiding all the fun stuff along the way. <laughs> oh, <laughs> here, yeah. the Speaking road, of which, and then that's when everything falls apart. <laughs> oh, here. I'll, I, since you guys didn't see it, I'll turn off the fog of war. And it's amazing yes. so much could was, go wrong, but we, we still avoided the. <laughs> oh, yeah, we absolutely avoided just. You guys didn't. Eat, you, this is about all the further here. you guys made it. You basically were straight here, here, all the lower section, but you missed this one and you missed this one <laughs> by just one hex each. Oh, wow. Some interesting nice. locations. We got nowhere near where we're supposed to go. Nope, that's okay. way up here. <laughs> but they said the roads actually were more dangerous yeah, because they're patrolled by the bandits. I was going to say, yeah. And we just so happened to roll a one we right at the road. moment. <laughs> yep. <clears throat> but, all right. And I believe, Stephen, we need to check in with you. How are you this evening? Oh, well, uh, apart from blowing my nose every two minutes, uh, it was awesome. I enjoyed myself, uh, as always. Um, somewhere in Neverfall, the Goblin King is awaiting his 17th son to arrive at his seventh son's funeral. And he isn't showing up. So well, there's that. You just go on dad's piss list. So. <laughs> yeah. I'm already on there. <laughs> yeah. You're the 17th in line. No, now you're probably only the 
14th, 16th in line. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You'll get there someday. But all right, guys, you have uh, any last minute anything else from anybody? Otherwise, we're going to head on out and uh, have a good night. No arguments from here. No, good night. thank you. All right. Uh, please pay attention to uh, any postings or such at the stuff. And uh, I sh should be hopefully in two weeks. We'll have another one and we'll go from there. All right. So, awesome. Sweet. See you soon. See you I'm soon. I'm just going to end this.